Uh, we live? Seems good. Seems good. Volume disparity seems a bit off. Uh, let's crank this down a bit. Hmm. Maybe... Maybe like here. Alright, we'll give that a try. Alright, so... Oxygen not included. Let's go. Survival, of course. And I'm just going to go for the default destination, since I've never actually played Oxygen Not Included through to completion before. Promising location with a balanced variety of resources. Fantastic. Uh, game settings? I don't think... Duplicants have perfected clothes manufacturing and are able to make suits that last forever. Alright, well, we're going for default settings for the first playthrough, I think. Um, what else? Start game? I thought I was going to get to choose my first few, uh, duplicants. Or is that about to happen now? All right, here we go. Um, so what skills do we value early on? I think mining more than anything else. Um, probably... Does machinery count for running those little... Uh, uh, not bicycles, but little hamster wheel generators? I think it's more about what traits we do or don't want to see as well. Uh, decreased bathroom use speed I don't think is too bad. Machinery... Cooking and supplying. It sounds pretty mediocre. Uh, farming and ranching. We'll definitely want one of those at one point, but... I don't think that's what we want for our first duplicant. Uh, let's re-roll. Nothing but farming. No thanks. Uh, nothing but farming. Athletics. Run speed. That's nice. Decorating doesn't... isn't so good yet. Uh, machinery. I don't think this is good enough for a start. Let's start by looking for skills. Do I need to actually pick one of these? Or are the rerolls just going to keep trolling me? Wow, not Factorio, I'm surprised. Dark sky full of stars. Good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, I'm branching out a bit more since finishing K2... Uh, sorry, Space Exploration. Uh, I am starting... I did just start K2 plus SE. We're still going to be doing that a couple of days a week. Um, but just as much oxygen not included. And for now, at least, just as much Terraria. Um, so we're going to keep re-rolling this until we get... Excavation, that is pretty good. Medicine, probably not as much. We don't want a mouth breather. Get out of here. Um, maybe I should pick some of these. I, I definitely want a miner, a digger. Here we go. Um, nothing but digging? That's probably pretty good to start with, honestly. Increased cuisine, cooking speed, decreased machinery, that's pretty 
tolerable for a downside. You want a great digger and builder? Yeah, I figured. Uh, overjoyed response, strikes reaction. All right, this this seems okay. We'll stick with bubbles. And then, whoops, I didn't even mean to do that yet. Uh, we'll go builder. Construction athletics. Uh, maybe I should have looked at that for longer. Strength is carrying capacity. Does that matter for a builder? Or does someone else bring the stuff? You'll need a lot of food, she'll eat it all? That's only, only if she gets stressed out, right? Oh, I don't think I want to deal with flatulent, though. Have, I don't want to have to deal with random natural gas lying around, um, like, in the early game before I even know what to do about it. Unpracticed artist. Decreased creativity and decor morale bonus. Um, I think that's fine, considering this is a builder. I want more of a specialist. Athletics and construction, that's pretty good. Cannot do research, that's fine. Yeah, this is perfect. And then for our third one... Uh, can we just keep this? Cooking and supplying? I think that's fine. We don't have to min-max it that much, right? What's What should the colony be called? She just toots like you? Wait, what? She toots. Uh, what should we call the colony? Let's, ra let's randomize it. The happy laboratory? This is fine. You said you didn't want a crazy farter? Yeah, we don't have one. I, I re-rolled him. What, a tea hacks only stream? Yes, indeed. Thunion, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. I think we'll go with this. Uh, and I should probably add a viewer reward to name a duplicate. We'll do that in a little bit. I've awoken at the target location, but colonization efforts have already hit a hitch. I was supposed to land on the planet's surface, but become trapped many miles underground instead. Conditions are not ideal. It's imperative we get started. Okay. Uh, pause it. Space. And... I need to try to remember what little I have learned already playing this game. Um, we can issue orders as much as we like while the game is paused. And first thing we want to do is mark some stuff out for digging. Um, I think I want to go this way first. So how do I... Is there a tutorial that kicks in? Here we go. No outhouse built. No oxygen generator. That's not really what I'm looking for. Only poggers. Yes, indeed. Court gaming. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Uh, dig. Here we go. And I do recall we want... We want our rooms to have a height of four. Um, otherwise, we're going to run into stuff not being able to fit. Click dig. Yes, indeed. Uh, is there anything else I want to queue up already? Probably not. Um, can we use this as a natural farm? For now? Probably. If I recall correctly, the, uh, what is it called? Oxylite will give us more oxygen over time if we don't dig it. So I'll avoid that where I can. 
Um, let's just get started with this. Fantastic. This only stores food, right? Yeah, I think that's right. Should we go into schedule already? You want to start with getting beds and food. Yeah. Oh, we got a shine bug in here. Alright, I do want to make sure... That's a good point. I do want to make sure we have beds before the first night. Furniture? Cot. Alright, and I think... We'll change it later, but I th think I want... Uh, a ladder right about here. I can build a ladder already, surely. Yep, there it is. And we can make this a room so it counts as... Uh, is there not a better shortcut for that? Tile, there we go. I think we want doors like so. How many beds could we have in one room before the, the dupes get upset, I wonder? Let's go... Can I not do a door? Requires... Metal. Okay. It won't... It won't even let me queue it up. Until we've got some metal. We're about to have some metal anyway. If I recall correctly, uh, can I, like, copy this? What's the copy button? I'm pretty sure there was a copy button. Well, I have to fix. Wait, I told you not to dig this bit, did I not? Oh well. Let's put that there. And this goes here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's... Oh, once we've built it, there's a button to copy it, I think. Copy settings is not what I'm looking for. Oh, there it is. Copy. B. Alright. So, presumably we can use that when we don't even have the resources. Uh, this guy's idle. Muckroot. If I recall, it's not going to grow back or anything. We just... That's just free food once off. Uh, harvest. Why? And harvesting this other stuff... Uh, they're just going to leave it there. The meal wood, for example. Unless I tell them to dig it up. And why don't we get ahead of things with another cot? Does this get marked as a room already? How do I check that? Outhouse built. That kind of matters. Um, why don't we build it over here, maybe? And 
We'll have a water supply nice and close to where we're going to build our sink. I think. Hi, T Hex, Vin Shady, Lazaric, good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Epic to see you play Oni, new to the game, I assume. Uh, yes and no. I I only got to maybe the mid game before, and I haven't played it in a long time. Uh, so I'm actually relearning the controls at this point. So effectively, pretty new. Yeah. Uh, what's the button? G for dig. And get through here as well. We can make a sink already, right? Plumbing. Uh, pitcher pump. I want to figure out where some other things are going before that. Um, we shouldn't need more than a couple of them using outhouses at the same time just yet. I think. Uh, but yeah, where, where do we get our sink from? Pitcher pump, outhouse, bottle, emptier. Oh, it's under medicine. Wash basin. And once we put that down, we can configure it so that they wash their hands when they leave this room. Although, now that I think of it, I suppose it would be possible for them to draw water from here, uh, use the bathroom, draw water, and then contaminated water gets somewhere or other. Uh, that would be a little bit bad. How about ladder down here, and we'll put we'll put our pump thing. Uh, what is it called? Uh, we'll put our pitcher pump right about here. If I put it one tile further down. We could get all of this water eventually. I'm sure. I'm sure it will take quite a while to go through that at this point. Ceiling collapse. Oh, I forgot to read that. Uh, is he okay? He doesn't have like hit points that he's lost. No, here he is. Health one hundred. Glacia Wolf, good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. He's cold. Uh, is no one going to build this tile here? Can I crank up the priority? What are you guys doing? How many people are idle? Can I check? Uh... Population 3, 0% stress, lots of food, I think. Recovering from Factorio? Yeah, uh, I'm still playing Factorio, just not, uh, oh, that's got some, that's got some gas. I, I believe this is carbon dioxide, yeah. How do I, it, it's the function keys, isn't it? F1 shows us, this is all oxygen, that's a bit less oxygen, this is carbon dioxide. Okay, that shouldn't be too bad. Uh, yeah, still doing K2SE, that's going to be on the weekends. Since we just finished the SE playthrough. Now, if I recall correctly, whenever you deconstruct things in this game, you don't lose any resources. What the... Okay. 
And then we need some outhouses. This is new. Another game in my loop of games. Nice. Maholic. Good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Brain got to brain. Yes, indeed. I forget you moved on to other games to decompress a bit. Yeah, I did say I was going to um, kind of take a bit of a break from Factorio when finishing Space Exploration. I mean, it was beyond a marathon. Um... Sure what else I should be doing right now. I guess our builder is the only one who can build, so we've got idle. Not nope. faulting you for that decision at all? Yeah, I, I hope not. He fell asleep without going to bed. Why? Well, we're already off to kind of a bad start. He's not going to get good rest, either. Wait, what, what does tab do? Game speed. It was running like... Running from North America to South America and back. And then building a land bridge to Europe? Wait, what? Oh, it was like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I guess we speed things up until morning. I want to slow things down down just a little bit here so I don't miss the details and leave people sitting idle too long. No oxygen generator, that's fine. We got bed and bath. One toilet and a bed for everyone. Fantastic. Unreachable toilet. How? How? Oh, you're joking. Oh, come on. You didn't dig this because... Oh, I guess he's using the bathroom. Okay, now will you dig this? Alright. Merlin the Mage, thank you for the follow. Oh, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Can we get some tiles in? Whoa. Tiles in here. And I guess this can be a generator room. Where do we get generator from? Manual generator. Here we go. Um, so we've got Generator, battery, wire. That's pretty much it. What do we need it for? An oxygen... Diffuser? Seems good. And a research station as well. I'm just going to put all those things next to each other to start with. Research station and oxygen diffuser. How do I do the? There we go. Colony requires a food source. I mean, we've got these plants. I did mark them for harvesting, right? Yeah. Let's get in here as well. Um, I don't really want to dig the oxalite, but I might have to. Emitting oxygen zero. Is that because we're saturated here at the moment? Yeah, it looks... Oh wait, it keeps flickering. Yeah, I think it's because this is all oxygen. And then, once some oxygen gets consumed, it emits some more. So it's hard to get an idea of how 
quickly this is going to run out. One hundred and four point three two one zero. It's actually running out kind of quickly. And this is on normal game speed, or slow, if you like. All right, let's speed it up a bit. Cycle two. When do we get more stuff? Next print one point two cycles. Fantastic. Oh, we still haven't built this? We need the uh, wash basin functioning. How do I... Set direction left. So when they're leaving the outhouse, they're going to use the wash basin. And we got research. Colony requires a food source, so you keep telling me. Can we even make a farm or anything yet? Microbe musher. Oh yeah, we literally turned dirt into food, don't we? Can we skip that, or... I should probably have it at least as a backup. We're just going to put all this electrical stuff together for the moment. I do recall the batteries slowly discharge in this game, and the first tier is pretty bad. Uh, let's see. Power leak, 1000 joules per cycle. Maximum 10 kilojoules. It only loses a tenth of its charge in a whole day. That's not that bad. Alright, microbe masher. We don't have any of this, do we? Meal lice, I think we get from mealwood? Plus water. I don't really want to be consuming water just yet, do I? Oh, mush bar also requires water. Never mind. In fact, it requires more of it. Dirt and water. Uh, let's just make sure there's ten of them. I'm sure it's the last thing the dupes want to eat, so that'll be emergency rations. We don't have a uh, wire. A lot, of a lot of carbon dioxide down here. What else can we make? Uh, what can we research? Basic farming seems good. Uh, we'll definitely do meal prep. What should we prioritize though? There's quite a lot to choose from. I know we need uh, some kind of advanced research, uh, like a better research station for this red stuff. Colony development. Supercomputer. Advanced research. Seems water. Okay, cool. Uh, what is this? Crafting station. I haven't seen that before. Was that added in? Well, whatever the case, I think 
Uh, farming is probably as good as anything else to start with. Standard is researching basic farming to get stable food. Yeah. And we'll get some... Uh, where's the research screen? How do I... Backspace. That's kind of a weird shortcut. Uh, meal prep is going to make them a bit happier as well. Oh, and I want the farm tile. Food safety. The food make duplicates cook will only ever be as clean as the ingredients used to make it. Storing food in sterile or refrigerated environments keeps them free of germs. Carefully placed hygiene stations like a wash basin or shower will prevent the cooks from infecting the food. Uh, I guess our microbe masher is in the wrong place already. Dangerously contaminated food can be sent to compost. Okay. What was that? Schedule? Uh, yep, yeah, that's downtime. Alright, cool. And let's fast forward through the night. And actually sleeping in a barracks this time. Fantastic. How do I... Is it one of these buttons? Oh, it's up here somewhere, isn't it? Room overlay F11. That's what I was looking for before. Barracks, morale bonus. Uh, 32 tiles. It can be 12 to 64, so double this is as big as the barracks can go. Single bed, no industrial machinery. Room size. Alright, cool. Um, why don't we get ahead of this? Two, three, four. And we won't have to worry about making sure our dupes are housed for a minute. out these, uh, these little bonuses as well. Where's our digger? Current to-do list, all of the digging that he's researching. Um, skills. That's not quite what I was looking for. Uh, priorities? Here we go. So... Bubbles is actually our best digger. Oh, this and this is our constructor. What is Bubbles doing? Lots of digging, I guess. Uh, priorities. Let's just go by what they're good at for the moment. Seems fine. No stress. Two slash zero morale. Morale must exceed their morale need or they'll begin to accumulate stress. Increased by providing duplicates higher quality food. Downtime, bathrooms, bedrooms. Morale need zero. 
So their morale need increases when they learn skills? Does that mean I could just... If I don't assign skills to them when they level up, do they not... Uh, does their morale need stay low? Never really considered that possibility before. Is printing. We can have some seeds. Or we can have a dupe. What do we got? Let's look at the downsides first. Decreased construction, I don't particularly care. Except that they also have building. That's pretty bad. But as long as it's not like... Um, farting or something like that is what I'm more concerned about. With skills higher than morale, they get unhappy. Stress, chaos. Okay. So we may actually want to take our time giving them skills sometimes. Plant murderer? <laughs> oh no. Small bladder sounds like a nuisance. Starts with a tier one skill. Uh, it doesn't necessarily sound good. Tidying and ranching, supplying, building, and digging. That's actually kind of good right now. Just a bit worse at construction. So what is their construction skill? We got plus two and minus three. Uh... Mm. Ugly crier? Oh no. Uh, tidying, research, cooking. We don't have anyone with the research skill, right? Or is it a more of a stat? Cooking, tidying, and researching. That is actually kind of a good... Kind of a good fit for the moment. Let's take Amari. And priorities, research, uh, where's research? Here it is. Skill one, skill zero. Okay, so white is like slightly better than this gray. Gray is actually zero or negative. Well, you're our best researcher, so why don't you prioritize that? Uh, research complete. Fantastic. And doesn't mean we've done meal prep, though. Uh, so we have compost, planter box, ration box, and algae terrarium. From what I recall... Terrariums are actually kind of a newbie trap. Gains a 10% efficiency boost in direct light. Um, so the terrarium consumes algae to produce oxygen and remove some carbon dioxide. Uh, so like a powerless oxygen diffuser that requires little to no maintenance. But if I remember correctly, it outputs... Uh, Polluted water. Yeah. And also carbon dioxide? But it's like a tiny amount. Yeah, the polluted water is not something you want to deal with as a new player, from what I remember. Morning, morning, undead hunter. Good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Uh, compost, we're gonna need... Should I put it next to the bathroom? Next to our outhouses? 
How much back seating? Uh, not a whole lot. I will need help, I think, though. But I want to learn. I, I want to figure it out for myself, um, for the most part. Terrarium eat algae and water like crazy and give pH 2 zero. I avoid them when I can. Okay. Uh, what else should we d be doing? Who's idle? Can we tell how many people are idle? Or do we not have anyone idle right now? Does it say here? Insufficient oxygen generation. That doesn't seem right. Yeah, that that actually seems false right now. We've got oxygen everywhere. Default schedule downtime. Um, I should probably think about changing the schedule at some point. We don't really need to give them more morale just yet, though. The oxalite blocks will get you through the beginning of the game. Yeah, I figured. They do take a while to run out. Actually, this one's down to 82 kilograms already. It was over 100 before. We're already on fast forward. Okay. I remember we could uh, domesticate these things. Let's slow this down a bit. Make sure everyone's busy. Seems good. Default schedule work. Uh, we need a storage, right? And we should probably allow mush bars to be put in here. How full is this? 30 out of 150 kilograms. Alright. I can't remember what the daily consumption is for a dupe, though, for oxygen. I think it varies, but only only when they have, like, a special trait, right? Breath. 0.9% per second? Oh, that's if they're, like, drowning or something. Hmm... Yeah, I'm not sure. Mouth breather, yeah. Ooh, that didn't take long to find. Uh, I don't know. We don't want to dig into chlorine gas, though, do we? I seem to remember that being a lot less scary in this game than it would normally be. It's also some iron. I don't think we can dig some of this just yet. Um, and we probably want, like, an airlock tile as well. Nice that it tells you the measurement here, that's good. Um, yeah, I think we'll... We'll make a start in that direction. Mixed gases is a pain. Um, pinch of pepper. Sounds delicious. Alright. I should probably hurry up and figure out what kind of, like, grid layout I want. But I, I, I'm definitely going to have to play through a certain amount before I get a feel again for, like, 
Uh, I don't remember, like, how many tiles wide the ladder area should be. Whether we leave room for conduits and stuff there. I'm thinking maybe we'll just go for, like, 16 by 4 and some ladders between them all or something. Usually three. All right, we can definitely dig this out. Put some tiles here. Three tile gap between rooms. Uh, any reason in particular? Like, always between rooms, or between just some of the rooms? Actually, we won't be able to get up there if I do that. Can they jump that? So you can have a tube, ladder, slide pole. What is a tube? Oh, like late game uh, pneumatic tube kind of transport thing? farm up here. Let's go get it. Uh, that's kind of in the way. We can replant it, right? How's our research? Almost kind of done. Uh, I think I'll just put this here for now. that away. Paku. Yep, this is that art style. Alright, should we speed things up a bit at this point? Oh, and I was gonna... I think I'll just put a ladder here. I can jump across this, right? Maybe I should already be thinking about somewhere to put a water room. I'm sure it's fine. No research selected. Fantastic. Uh, what do we want? We can get better batteries. Root force refinement. I do want to see what this crafting station is, and we may as well get the supercomputer as well. Alright, let's get that done for now. D 
diggy diggy hole. 1.9 cycles till we get our next print. Uh, 38k calories. I should probably keep an eye on that. I can see a graph for how it's been doing, right? Where do I... Here we go. Colony report? Colony summary? Calorie generation. Calorie consumption. There's more area under this graph, so we're probably fine. Was on the first line of the previous page. First line... Wait, what? First line of the previous page. Uh, which page? The daily reports? First line... Oh, calorie generation removed net minus 1800. Uh-oh. But... That doesn't really tell us the story over... Like, all three cycles. Added 1200, 1200. Okay, we're losing food. Let's hurry up and get a farm. Maybe here? Did I not pick research? I did. Okay. Uh, farm tile. I remember there's a version of this that auto hydrates from pipes. Uh, but I don't think we'll worry about that just yet. I should have done that before placing those tiles there. It's fine. Can we priority up this? bump up this priority as well because I want them to be able to access this food unrefrigerated food you don't say all right, we can. We've got eleven mealwood seeds, a couple of blossom seeds. What are those? This plant produces edible bristleberries. Okay, life cycle six. We'll put those towards the back. So mealwood. Uh, copy settings. Fantastic. Oh, and I seem to remember a little too late actually. There's a there's like a building that's like two by two or something. You put it in a farm and it makes farm work better. It's fine. Why don't we put a mess hall up here, maybe? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and one, two. And that should probably have a set for a while. 
Research complete. Uh, that's a lie. We haven't done advanced research yet. I mean, we've done this. What is a crafting station? Uh, water cooler's going to go up here, I think. Crafting station. Produces items and equipment for duplicant use. Duplicant use. Um, these things don't draw this much power while they're idle, right? Right? None? Okay. All going pretty smoothly so far. Uh, we need some storage, I guess. If we want to tidy things up a bit. But for starters... Have a water cooler, S tables, and whatever else we'll add in here later for a bit of decoration to make a nicer mess hall. Alright, so is this a room of some kind? Apparently not. What makes a farm? Or is there no such room? Greenhouse? Needs a farm station. Maximum 96 tiles. This is 64. That's pretty good. Need later game? Okay. Uh, we harvested this, right? Yeah, we did. Fantastic. Uh, what's your problem? No illumination. Okay, I didn't think of that. Um, do we even have lights? Or does that have... Do we have to research the light bulb? As we've got all these machines here. Let's see... Power... Uh, it, would it be under food? I doubt... I don't think so. Furniture slash decor. Here we go. Ceiling light. That's what I'm looking for. We'll wait till this research is done. Hi everyone, hope you're doing well. Rubber Band Rambo, good to see you again. Welcome, welcome, hope you're doing well. Late for the start of this one? Not by much. We're just getting started. This is this is the entire colony on this one screen. Oh, 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 I missed printing. Uh no I didn't. Next Production 0.6 cycles. Why does this have skill points available? Okay. We got... Morale need is going to be plus... Wait, what? Okay, so if I take one of these skills, morale need goes up by one. Um... But the ones with the heart on them are, are different, right? How are they different? What? Oh, I meant to just look. I, I only wanted to look. Oh, no. It's fine, probably. They get morale for the heart. Okay. 
How much morale did he get from that? Is it like one morale? Morale needed two. Alright, well, you are just wanting to grill. Uh, John is our... Who is our main constructor? Probably Sean. Uh, how do I see... Constructing... Building. Uh, it is indeed Sean. Jean's construction skill, three. Fantastic. Oh, here it is. I can mouse over it here. Alright, so that's a pretty easy choice. Uh, morale 1 plus 1. Morale needs 0 plus 1. So he's going to be in the same position morale-wise as far as we're concerned. Rooms is easiest way to boost morale. You're already working on the mess hall. That'll give morale as well. Fantastic. Uh, Otto is... For cooking. Uh, that is better than... Oh, that's right. This one had negative cooking, even though he liked cooking. Whatever. It's fine. Uh, cooking, machinery, strength. Strength is like carrying capacity, right? That actually gives him morale. We could just go for that, for now. Um, machinery, athletics. Well, we'll give him what he wants. Improved carrying, sure. And Bubbles has not yet... leveled up? Why is that? Just behind the curve. How do they level up? Is it like an XP thingy or is it different? Tutorial Atmo suits. That sounds like it's a bit far away. Oh, I thought that was a video thing. We've discovered employment technology, water cooler crafting station. Fantastic. <laughs> Okay. Uh, oh, we got the crafting station. So what can we do with this? Current order, no workable order. Discover new ingredients or research new technology to unlock some recipes. We don't have any yet. Okay. Um, I thought... So this was a one-off that I produced ten of these? I thought it was on forever. Uh... Wait, wait, what? Can I not set it so that we make sure that we have 10 mush bars and then we stop? Doing anything gives XP. Okay. Yeah, what? Can I not automate this to, to have a set target? It's either forever or fixed amount? Oh no. Oh no. Um, sure. You can probably automate it. Okay. Uh, default work schedule. Bubbles earned a skill point. There we go. She is our digger, and she loves digging, and she shall dig. Fantastic. Easy choice. Colony summary. Oh, was that because we got that? Um, that's neat. Was that because we got the achievement, or is it just a daily report or something? Calorie... 
Okay. Away here we go. Research is taking its sweet time, but I guess we do it we do just have one basic research station and one basic researcher. Shouldn't expect too much. Uh diagnostics, breathability sixty two percent oh, it's up here. Well there's your problem. That CO2 is gonna come down here sooner or later. All for going to bed is wasted time. But won't they get upset if they don't sleep? Or do you mean at the same time? We don't have any night owls or anything. People get assigned to this, right? Like, automatically? So there's only two sleeping at the same time. Create non-overlapping schedules. I like them working at the same time. They are friends. Indeed. They get something out of socializing, right? Going on breaks at the same time. Schedule period key. Okay. I seem to remember this game throwing videos at me. Um, but maybe not. Research. I was going to do the lights next. Do I want to do this as well? Probably. And we can already start doing smart stuff. In theory, duplicate motion sensor, automation wire. I get the feeling we're going to need more stuff before we can make the most of that. Uh, let's actually do some artistic expression. Hey, Mike Black, Breaker, Vlad, good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Sassiana, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well also. You don't get debuffs for sleeping on wrong time. Don't use metal for that yet. Stupid copper always runs out. Okay. Um, can they reach this ceiling to build? I guess if I do this, they will. Choose a blueprint. Purple polyester? <laughs> Wait. Increases decor in a small area around the wearer. So this is basically a, mor a walking morale boost. Two tiles high is max reach. Okay. We got an all-rounder with no real downside. We've got a big researcher with no real downside. And... Tidying research. Could, yeah, I think we're going for Gossman. On the other hand, how often am I going to see something like this? No, it's fine. Give me the researcher. Priorities. Research. Uh, and go. Seems good. 
research is pretty important. Yeah, especially at this stage. You can play this like Factorio and be mean and use multiple schedules, or play it like Sims and be kind and make one big schedule. Exaggerated playstyle dependent. Okay. How many dupes do we have now? Uh, six, I think. Five. Oh, they're doing kind of a loop here where they only do a little bit at a time. Hopefully now they can speed this up a bit. Should probably lower the priority on that since I don't actually need it done real soon. Optimize everything? Don't optimize everything? Uh-oh. Oh, um, what are we researching? Oh, we already got the, the light. Did we not? We do need a supercomputer. How much power does this use? Consumes water as well. Well, I'm still going to shove it down here. At least for now. What's that? Water. Why is there a random jug of water here? Uh, power. No. Furniture? No. Did we not do that research? We did. Oh wait, no, this one's 14 out of 50. Okay, never mind. Okay. I'll just mark those as seen. Skill scrubber. Hopefully we won't be needing that. Alright, does this have the same settings as this one? No. Alright, so... One more point of research. Where's our researcher? There he is. Also, can I... Maybe... Give you the research hat? I guess I have to give you advanced research first. There we go. Fantastic. Uh, and we should be able to make a ceiling light now. Does the meal would hate light, per perchance? I hope not. Doesn't look like it. Requirements. Yeah, no, we're good. Okay. So we're just gonna put this over here. And then run some wire through here. This thing doesn't use a whole lot, if I recall. Dupes aren't real people? Yes, they are. Look at them. Hatches excrete solid coal as waste and may be uncovered by digging up buried objects. Digestion. Diet. Sand, stand, sandstone, clay, crushed rock, dirt, sedimentary rock, nutrient bar, mush bar, meal lice, muckroot, excellent fruit, mushroom, lettuce, meat, bristleberry, paku fillet. Is there anything they don't eat? I 
I think that's the real question. There's something. I am this guy. Good to see you again. Well, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Morale plus three. Nice. That was better than I thought it would be already. Uh, mess table, no industrial machinery. Maximum size 64, which it is. Uh, we've got three tables unassigned still. Can we make it better? Great hall. Can actually be bigger. 32 to 120. Plus 20 decor, recreational building. This is a recreational building, right? Yes. I, I presume so. It says water cooler is outside of rec room. So we just need plus 20 decor, which I think is what we're researching here. Oh, we've got it. Okay. Um, furniture. Corner molding. Can I flip it? How do I... There we go. Half a rotation. How much decor do we get from this? Plus five. We need plus 20. So is that all it takes? Um, I recall as well we can take plants like this one. Uh, decor plus 25, radius 4 tiles. So, exclude, exude pheromones, causing critters to view them as ex especially beautiful. That's kind of spooky. Uh, hanging pot houses a single plant when sown with a seed. Increases decor, contributing to morale. Decor plus 10%. Considering the radius of the briar plant, I think I should put them like here. Um, probably like that. And does this do the same thing? Enables plant domestication. Placing a plant in a wall pot, add a spot of decor. Enables plant domestication. Yeah, it's the same. Okay, cool. And flower pot, I presume, is pretty much the same thing, but on the ground. Excellent. Oh, the ceiling light uses more power than the lamp. Interesting. Same amount of heat. More radius from... whoops, whoops, whoops. Uh, furniture. Light range, eight tiles. Light range, four tiles. Depends on how you place it, right? We'd need a pretty high ceiling to really take advantage of this, it looks like. So, if we're going to do our ceilings four tiles high, it seems like lamps are better, except that if we want to fill this floor space, that's not quite true. Sculpting block. We'll skip that for now. Uh, what else was here? Ice block? It's just like the sculpting block, but it's ice. Pedestal. Objects with negative decor will gain some positive decor when displayed. Displays a single object doubling its decor value. So I can put anything on this? Lol. Alright, let's see how 
There we go, briar seed. Go. Let's see how our room is going to look. There it is, it's a great hole. Fantastic. Alright, so morale bonus plus six. That is a pretty good start. Uh, we got idle dupes. Let's let's do some more digging and stuff, I guess. Two, three, four. Uh, something like this. And so on. I think I'll just make these rooms 64 by and let the printing pod just occupy a room. Um, so that's what... How big's the interior here? 16 by 4, of course. Except we'll let that diffuse automatically. Uh, don't remove that yet. Should probably figure out a proper outhouse situation as well. I guess we've almost finished moving this whole farm. Uh, didn't I set this to be blossom seed? Didn't we have two blossom seeds? Oh wait, no, we did two here already. I was going to save this spot for... Um, uh, for the farm thingamajig. I should probably move these two plants here so that the dupes have better access to that. I forget what it's called. Alright, so far so good. How's our oxygen looking? A little thin, perhaps. I mean, we did just open up a bunch of new space, but... What's that sound? Work schedule? Oh, we got the automation overlay. So can we actually use some of this already? Uh, doesn't look like it. Refined metal? Well, that's not happening yet. Uh, we did gain the overlay. What is this? Oh, right, okay. Uh, carry on. What should we be researching? Textile loom? Ventilation might be good to have. Oh yeah, I did want um, an airlock before we go into that place. Carbon skimmer, deodorizer. Those seem like a good idea. Advanced caffeination? Sign me up. Pressure management. Gas valve, liquid valve, airflow tile.
Maybe I should put some airflow tiles in at the walls in particular. Plumbing. I know we're going to be needing that. Water CF produces clean water from polluted water. I do recall needing that relatively early. I mean... Yeah. I'll have to knock all of these off sooner or later. Are you playing with the DLC? Uh, wasn't actually aware there was DLC, so no. Probably not. Wait, let's, um, let's leave those there so that they can reach. Just put some ladders in temporarily. They should be able to build the rest of that. Research complete. That was pretty quick, actually. Where are we up to? Filtration time. Hey, Whiskers. Good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Spaced out adds some very good content. Okay. Well, I think I should probably get to the point where I would ever be getting to space first. Alright. Good job. Well done, you. And I guess I should probably... I want to see how many... I, I want to see how much reach they have here. Do I need one or two bits of ladder? How far apart do they need to be? Let's deliberately put them too far apart, probably. Research complete. We're on a roll. Almost got distillation already. Kind of. Oh, I never plugged this in. Minor detail. Wait, um, these... Wires can hold. They can deal with 1,000 watts at a time. We're up to 480, uh, 540, 600. Oh, plus this. 610. Okay. Even if everything ran at the same time, the wires wouldn't overload just yet. You can space the ladders vertically and horizontally one by one square, and they can make the jump? Oh, wow. Wait, wait, wait. Are there going to be any tiles this guy can't reach from here? When I saw him doing this one, I thought that we actually had full coverage here already. But I'm guessing there's going to be at least one tile in the middle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. If they can reach this one, I'll be pleasantly surprised. And we don't find out yet. They can only reach sideways like two tiles. Okay. Actually, if they're still working... Yeah, you might be... Might be right there. Ladder has to, doesn't have to be sitting on the floor. Can I just build it in the sky like this? Yes. <laughs> okay. That's valid. Okay. How did we end up with more water here? I'm pretty sure that was less full before. 
Maybe I'm misremembering. Anyone got skills? No. Uh, how close is our digger getting? Not even. Super hard digging. Is that what we need to get through this? Uh, skill required dig. I'm guessing... I'm guessing one of these diamonds means we need uh, super hard digging and two would probably need super duper hard digging. <laughs> Perfect. No notes. Seen a YouTuber regularly make Linko layout to dig out huge sections of the map. Linko layout. Uh, let's do it here. Because I, I want to actually see if they will jump on that. They will indeed. Okay. One diamond is hard. If you can't dig it with your skills, it shows a red sign. Oh, so someone does have that kind of skill. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, okay. Cool. So we can do this already. Uh, let's get... Before we do... Uh, let's get ourselves... I don't think I've researched it yet. What is this? T. Attack tool. Uh, I don't think we're on our way to getting... Nice search. Manual airlock. Whoops. How do I... Nani? Airlock. Airlock. Okay. It actually shows it here. Alright. Um, I kind of wish I could queue up stuff that was not all in the same line of prerequisites. One off the floor will work, but any higher and they can't reach. Okay. Um, this is 64. Nope, that's 60. I messed up. I'm glad I double-checked that. Uh, this is a one-off, so let's just... Put that there. Oh, he's gonna get stuck. Uh, priority nine? Oh, he could squeeze through that. Okay. Gotta use mods for science queuing. Alright. Choose a blueprint. And then I'll take a little break after this. Or maybe I should take a break before we decide. I think you can choose a tech along the tree and they'll research everything in between. Yeah, you can click on something and it'll do all the prerequisites. Uh, we can get a cute baby shine bug. We can get a mule with no real... Actually... So does minus decor mean it takes more beauty spam? to give them any plus morale. Iron gut. Slow learner, small bladder, biohazardous. You sound like a winner. Farming, doctoring, cooking. That's really not that exciting right now. Supply. Okay, so we, we've got two mules to choose from. 
comes with hard digging as well. Increased cuisine. Green thumb. Plus three agriculture. Falls asleep periodically? I don't want that. I think we're going with Adder. Dupes themselves have a decor score. It will affect the overall score that other dupes are experiencing as this one passes by. Shabby dresser. Oh. Okay. That's unfortunate, but... Hmm. So how does this work? Like, if they're in the mess hall, there's way more than enough plus decor to offset it. In other places, does it even matter? Or is it just like for the room morale bonuses? Or are they going to get sad for a moment whenever they pass this, this person? Um, I think this is still the pick, though. I don't want narcoleptic. She'll be running around supplying stuff, so think of that context. Yeah, but is there, like, a constant effect on other dupes morale? Or, or is it just when she passes them, or how does that work? Um, all right, I think now's a good time to take a little break anyway. Uh, let's get some words on stream. And I'll be back in a few minutes. Uh, words on stream. The dupes average out the decor score they experienced in a day. And if it turns out to be good decor, they get a morale bonus. Okay. So really, that means we're really incentivized to put decor everywhere, right? Alright, let's get that background sound out of here. Alright. In about 30 seconds, we're going to start some words on stream. I'll be back in a few minutes. Good luck and have fun.
How'd you all do? Smashed level 3. Alright, we'll continue that in... I want to say about 90 minutes. I'll try and make my breaks a bit more regular. And pause that for now. Fantastic. Alright, so I think we will go for Ada. Um, I kind of want to see exactly how bad this is as well, so let's find out. Let's fuck around and find out. It's fine. What's the worst? That, what's the worst that could happen? Out of order, entombed. No, thank you. There we go. Are you stuck? Idle, hungry, holding breath. Okay. When low-level dupes don't have a high decor requirement, it's only late game when dupes are high level. Okay. Um, we can get rid of that now. Get rid of that now. We can fix this now. So that's again 64 tiles. Um, should the bathroom be anywhere in particular when we make a proper one? We can put it close to the cots, I guess. That makes a lot of sense, I think. Uh, let's see. 64 tiles. And clear out the top ones first, so that we don't have to make ladders. In fact, if I just do it like this, they'll get it done, right? Oops. Wait, did I just mouse over that, press B? That is how that worked. Cool, one less click. And I think we'll have... Oh, wait. I forgot. Uh, I was going to make th this the recommended three tiles of width later on. So... So that would imply moving this over a bit more. Um... If this is going to be three tiles wide, this is going to go here, this is going to go here, and this is 64 tiles, I think, that's 72, wait, what? Oh, hey, yep, 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 can I, can I not, okay, right click is drag the screen around, 64. Four. Okay, perfect. Um, so that goes there, that goes there, that goes there actually. Get rid of all this. And... Yeah, let's do it like that. Can they jump, like, two tiles if there's just a ladder here? Or would the ladder have to be in the middle? And the, the the pole that they can slide down on would have to be on the side. Good idea. Oops, good time to move food into the CO2 pit. That's a good point. I, I didn't remember that you could use carbon dioxide. Um to preserve food. Um, how would I go about that? Well, let's find out. Let's find out if the ladder will have to be moved. You've got two CO2 pits already? Yeah, but how do I, um... I mean, I could make a... Ration box, I guess. Hmm. 
Hmm. I mean, it's not like a permanent spot that I want to keep this in. It doesn't have to be. And deconstruct the other one? Okay. I'm gonna guess that they're not gonna be able to jump this gap here. So the ladder will have to be in the middle. I think I kind of prefer it that way. Aesthetically. Uh, why is this a ladder? Test this here as well. Actually, that would be three tiles, wouldn't it? Sand is gonna fall down. No research selected. I wanted the manual airlock, and while we're at it, why don't we get the deodorizer? We're still on default schedule. It's probably fine for now. You can build pit near your food area, but it needs space and breaks your four tile floors and it's it's not that backseat gamey. I have done it before, I just haven't played this in a while. I recall there's some farms where we're gonna want um, carbon dioxide so we're gonna have like instead of the usual layout here it's gonna be something like one, two, three, four... Oops. I can't put this here right now. Um, but just to illustrate, it's going to be more like this. Um, we could maybe have that double as a carbon dioxide food storage area. I just copy settings here and can I now is that all it takes to make them empty this looks like it I think maybe not oh yeah it's empty okay are you stuck uh, it looks like you're stuck. Okay. Good to know. Okay. That looked powerful. Are we going fast? No. Uh, how many dupes do we have now? Priorities? Six? Uh, some of these are still unassigned. Top left, six. Yeah, thank you. Um, can we please max priority these ladders? Max priority without it being emergency mode. There we go. And get rid of all that. Should probably do the same thing. Thing here. Uh, 
Make sure you're able to leave. Uh, there's no reason not to dig this up now, right? Research complete. Fantastic. Uh, are we researching? Yes, we are. No, we're not. Yes, we are. Decor, plus 20. Oh, does it only go by the best decor item? As opposed to the total? Is that how that works? Uh... I'm not seeing stats on this. Unsure? Okay. De decor overlay. There we go. Uh, they're not liking the crap that's on the ground here. I thought... Oh, here it is. Storage bin. Was that there the whole time? Uh, why don't we put some storage bins here. Decor is calculated per tile, only for rooms it's per room. Okay. It's time to start sweeping. Are these going to have any default settings? Probably not. And... Uh, you know what, we're just going to allow all. Actually... Yeah, sure. Let's just make all for the moment. Sweep only? Uh, we'll see. Let's try... I'll make this one sweep only. And do this. See what happens. Building entombment. Again. Insufficient oxygen generation. I think we're fine, actually. Why is this one still... Filters not designated. Oh, I have to do both of those? Okay. Uh, sweep. Where's the sweep button? Move debris to storage. So it's... Uh... K. Fantastic. Um, I would like to see that happen. So let's just prioritize it now. Nice. So it seems like they're still... Unless I set it to a top priority, they're still using their priority system here um, to decide who's doing what. So it's really just like supplying, and I'm guessing there's one for cleaning. Uh, storing and supplying. You need to mark stuff to sweep? Yeah. I think once this, uh, once this is grown, I'll transplant it. Oh, actually, we've got some over here. You know what? Let's put these here. And... I'll just 
replace that when we do get that technology. Also, why don't we... Do these things not have enough range on the decor? Three tiles. For it to make a difference. I guess this would have to go all the way across. Unless... Some plants would probably be better. I know we've only got one or two um, flowers to put in this. I kind of want to see what this will look like. Also, that's looking a lot better. Should probably sweep all of this up. Maybe if we're starting to care about the decor there. Um, this is definitely not the highest priority. The sweeping, though, is a little bit higher than normal. When do we get our next print? 1.5 cycles. Uh-oh. Out of order requires emptying. Okay, this one's working. It's fine. Uh, that should probably, probably be a pretty high priority. I do not want the dupes unable to go to the bathroom. Also, we've got some polluted water just sitting around off-gassing. Emitting polluted oxygen. It's not what I want to see. What can I do about it at this stage? Produces clean water and polluted... From polluted water using sand produces polluted dirt. Um, oh, I know. We need the... That thing I researched. Algae, distiller, slime plus power equals algae. I think we need algae for this thing, don't we? Converts large amounts of algae into oxygen. That's a yes. Ethanol distiller. Lumber into ethanol. Well, we don't have any lumber. And I don't know what I need ethanol for. So that can wait. Gas pipes. Uh, liquid pipes. Fantastic. Airflow tile. Maybe those should go like here. I think they have... Yeah, negative decor. Manual airlock. Uh, I was going to put this here. And why not put one down here? You got dirty water in your toilets. Temporary, you could build a pit far away. Mm. What are we researching? Uh, we're still researching the deodorizer. That's what I was trying to remember the name of. I don't really have room to put it right here either. But they're quite cheap to run, as I recall. They don't need electricity, they just need a little bit of sand. How is our decor looking? Not good yet. This thing is negative 25. Oh no. We got a skill point. Uh, I guess we should go for... 
Well, we've already got one doing advanced research. Um, oh, we've already got grilling for you. Hmm. Think about that. Improved carrying. This is the only thing you have a love for, is carrying things. Uh, okay then. Deodorizer need power since a few patches. Oh no. That's unfortunate. Alright, you are a hauler. You... Probably research. Definitely research. And... Uh, you can still wear the cooking hat since you're our best cook. Oh, and I forgot, I have to keep manually giving this... Um... Orders. We've got meal lice now, right? Apparently not. Uh, maybe I should double the farms here? Probably. We don't need the ceiling to be that high, but if I'm going to do something like this, I would like for it to line up with the grid. So how many... I'm going to get rid of this eventually. Um, how many times would I have to do this? Uh... Paint this down here. It's one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, yeah. Uh, this far down. I should change this room as well. but I'll change it into something else if I do this. So I'll have one, two, three, four, five. That seems like a good amount of farming for a while. And get rid of this for the moment. change this again. Should probably do a bit more planning. Also, this should be two tiles for, uh, I think it's two tiles um, for that one machine. This is going to be way more farm than we need for a while, and I'm totally fine with that. No power, no research being done. Uh, we're fine. It doesn't have to be 24-7. Uh, as soon as this gets harvested, in fact, let's make it get harvested right now. 
I'm gonna swap this tile out. I guess we don't have a farmer handy. The longer this sits not harvested, uh, the, the less food we're getting out, out of it overall, I imagine. Farming. We actually don't have anyone. Really. We've got our researcher. I guess for now... Farming is a higher priority. See ye Moogle. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. I have a question. Do you plan on keeping playing Crestorio SE? Yes. On the weekends I'll be doing Crestorio 2 plus SE. Uh, I have already started. Um, just, uh, I don't know, a couple of hours for K2SE. Just really basic stuff. Z uh, Zura, good to see you again. Oh, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Only for a kiss, what? We, we still didn't get this harvesting. That's a little disappointing. Thank you, no worries. Uh, yeah, I have put it in the schedule, and I think you can see it in the down there part as well. Let me just check. If you scroll down... No, it doesn't say what I'm doing on each day with the schedule thing there. But if you if you click on schedule, you can see it. Alright, let's uh, uproot this, and this one's like 60%. I don't want to waste that just yet. Oh, suffocating. Um, okay, that... That won't do. Uh, these two are still set to emergency priority. Okay. And replace that tile. Uh, I was going to say, let me also check if this is a farm, but we don't get to see... It doesn't get marked as a farm until we have... Here we go, greenhouse, farm station, 12 to 96 tiles. All right, so this will work. If it's too BSG, but you could block your dupes from eating mealworm. Oh yeah, no, that's not too backseat gaming. Yeah, I can stop them from eating the raw resource. Is that right? As opposed to the meal? Uh, let's see. How do I do that? Consumables? Uh, meal lice. And we can then order lice loaf forever, right? Is that what we want to do? Yeah, okay, cool. Thank you. Now that That's exactly the kind of backseat gaming I can appreciate. Um, let's bump the priority on this stuff. This will need a lot of water, so no solution long term. Uh, they can eat the mealwood, 
The mealwood will grow without water, right? Let's see. Air pressure, atmo, body temp. But this recipe requires water. Hmm. We're not about to run out of water or anything. But maybe... Especially if we're building this big of a farm. Maybe I should... Allow them to just eat the meal lice. We've still got 45k calories. At some point you could add name a dupe reward? Yeah, I was going to do that. Definitely. Uh, maybe I'll squeeze that in on the next break. Long term is 100 to 200 cycles, so no hurry. Okay. I don't think I've played to 200 before. Uh, how's our decor in this room? It's less terrible. Total decor plus 16. Uh, that's pretty good, actually. Oh, we haven't built this yet. Well. Or is that plus 16, like, for the whole room or something? No? Alright, what are we printing? Care package rust? How, how thoughtful. Iron oxide that forms on the from the breakdown of iron. I would have no idea what to do with that at the moment. Suit wearing and nothing else. Bottomless stomach. Uh, no thank you. And I mean, I, we're not very interested in this just yet. Surely. Night Owl. No attacking. Decreased as athletics. Supplying, farming, tidying. Uh, this would be our best farmer, right? Nisbit is slow? Yeah. But she's going to have a bunch of farming jobs in more or less all the same spot. Uh, decrease bathroom usage speed. Decrease construction. That basically doesn't matter. Farming, not as good. Operating, researching. I think we'll go for Nisbet. We don't need another all-rounder that does a bit of science. And priorities... Uh, farming. Now we've got a dedicated farmer. Everything else plus one prior seems pretty good. Alright, so how many seeds do we have? 19. Fantastic. Copy settings. How many is this? Uh, 14. We can do another 5 without... before we gain any more seeds. Very, very good. Nice low effort farming. What was that? Oh, and I didn't look at the summary earlier. Construct a building outside the initial starting biome. Amazing. 
Average power wasted. All of it. Uh, skills. Is bet. Farming. And have a farming hat. Fantastic. Did we empty this? Yeah, we did. I should leave this uh, generator as well. Uh, not yet. Cycle 12 report ready. Minus 5,000 calories. Minus, minus, plus. Plus, minus, minus, minus. Alright. We are losing calories, but we're in the process of building a big farm. I think I already looked at that. How's our oxygen? Ooh. Oh, thank you. Um, can I get this water moved? How about... Like that? this stuff over here. Back to sleep for me. Be good, everyone. Take care, Zura. Thanks for dropping by. Have a good sleep. Did we put our food in here? Yeah, we did. Fantastic. our research looking. 15 out of 20 on decontamination. Have we got any more seeds? Actually, I was going to say yes. Yeah, we do. I could move these so I can put the bristle blossoms in. No research focus. Fantastic. What else are we doing? Can we do better farming? That would be a good idea. Farm station. Uh, I hope that's not too tall for the rooms that we just made. Oh no. We also get a refrigerator. Classifies, classifies an area as a park or nature preserve. Preserve. Fertilizer. Juicer. Improves morale. Sure, why not? I have the sinking feeling that the uh, uh, the farm station is slightly too tall for what we just built here. Well, we're about to find out. Actually, why don't we just dig this over here? Take that. We're already harvesting those. 
Actually, why don't I move those into our farm? What's this? Otto has a skill. Uh, sure. Net negative one morale. But I don't think we have to worry too much about that. Have a better hat. Someone else just leveled up. Nope, never mind. Oh, we've half finished that crown molding. How does this look now? Decor plus a lot. Fantastic. What kind of ray does, radius does this have? Three tiles, supposedly, but pointing at this, it looks like it's further. Or is it three tiles diagonally? settings across. There we go. How about this one? 58%. I don't particularly want to uproot that. More skills. Uh, Jean. Better building. Fantastic. Alright, did we dig down here yet? Uh, we're on the way. First. Unreachable build. Oh, I see. already got the airlock. Very nice. What's this? Still we don't have anything that we can use the crafting station for. Fair enough. Building lacks resources. Oh, right. Meaning we can't make any lice loaf. Do we actually gain calories by doing this? Uh, yeah, we do. Like, oh, um, something like 40, 45 percent. And it costs 50 kilograms of water to make it happen. That... 50 kilograms? As in 50 liters of water. That seems like a lot. It seems like a lot for a single meal. Uh, field research? Absolutely. I think I like the look of the silver better. So you can keep your hat. What the? Oh, I thought he 
Oh, he didn't change his hat. That's why that was so quick. There's a lot of carbon dioxide down here. Ooh. Okay, we really do need more. Um... We really do need more oxygen generation at this point. Yeah, it's nice. I approve. Alright. That should be... I was gonna just move this uh, stuff over here, but I think I'll leave it for a little while. Until we catch up with oxygen again. Research and research. Fantastic. Ten out of thirty on the juicer. Oh, and now for the uh, now for the moment of truth. That's not the moment I was of truth I was looking for, but I guess I need a door to make this a park. That's a bit awkward, especially considering our shaft goes up the middle of it. But I don't see anywhere else that we would turn into a park. Um, why don't we Why don't we get this to go up here, and... At least for now... I'll do that. Uh, stations, farm station, it's too big. Okay. Well then. What, what, <laughs> yeah. Uh, I guess we gotta move all of this. Well, this, this can stay in the same spot. We move all of this up one. Uh, that's going to mean that fewer of these can fit under this light. But I'm not terribly concerned about that. This has to move down one. We haven't used this yet. So that's not that big of a deal. We did put our airlock here, though. But did, did any of the chlorine come through here? Or can we count on... Yeah, yeah, it did. Mm. I don't really want to mess with that just yet. So this stays here. This goes down one. Um. This is getting removed. These are getting removed. I'll leave this more or less untouched for the moment. And we need to uproot all this stuff. Fourth overlay from the left. 
is materials. Select gases and you can see where each gas is. Chlorine. Yeah, that's much easier to see. Thank you. All right. F4. It's like... It's like this, but sort of better and worse. Oh, we got some... Oh, oh, no. We've got rogue chlorine gas roaming around. I hope no one sniffs it and dies or something. Default schedule work. Food poisoning. Oh, no. Oh no. What can you do about that? Uh, well, this is a good time to move these ones. Oh, this is a very good time. 98%, 98, 95. I can't actually build this until... No, don't... Uh, don't give up 78% of the way through. Usually chlorine is no problem, as it is almost as heavy as CO2 and sinks near the bottom. Okay. Uh, we're not getting our... Oh, oh, oh. I broke it. Whoops. Maybe we should have another one of these generators. I definitely want to move this one anyway. And then put that back. did that wrong. Do we want to get these to finish growth halted illumination, but how much has it grown? Uh, we need to get this built to find out. Priority... This one, that's what I'm trying to get prioritized. Uh, apparently the wire is already there. It's just not connected the way I expected. Oh, and now it is connected without even adding anything. Okay, what do we got? Uh, let's do skills first. Bubbles is ready to dig. And blueprint. Uh, how many dupes do I have? Seven. So this is our last one until we make more beds. We've got uncultured. Loud sleeper, get out of here. Slow learner, unpracticed artist, uncultured again. Um, that's actually kind of positive, <laughs> uncultured is. 
increased decor morale bonus. Harry would be great on deliveries. Marie. Uh, plus eight athletics. Wow. Yeah, that's true. And the downsides are not very relevant. Bottomless stomach, get out of here. So unless I want rust, there's really only one choice here. And... I know we shouldn't just keep adding dupes forever. Should we stop at 8 for a while? Maybe it would be sensible. I mean, we're just hovering with our calories. Let's wait until we get our... Uh, um, our farms up and running before we think about adding more dupes. This should actually work as a couple of farm rooms, right? For the moment. I don't know if the diagonal is going to upset it or not. We need this built. Uh, yeah, the diagonal does work. So if you really want to min-max how you use your space, uh, I guess take that into consideration. That's a lot of mealwood. Fantastic. Um, why don't we prioritize this one since it's actually in a working room? How big is that room? 42 tiles. And this can be 12 to 96. Okay, cool. Colony lacks crop tending. Oh. Uh, alright, so I'm guessing we'll get that relatively soon. Uh, I didn't give Marie skills yet. This is the athletic... Uh, the very athletic person who also wants to grill. Let's get her towards exosuit training. Improved carrying? Yeah. Uh, but I wanted to look and see... Let's see, where's our farmer? Uh, crop tending. It's the next one. And she's already halfway there, almost. Do you have any dupe with interest in farming? Yes. Uh, Nisbet is quite interested in farming. Do we get anything out of this? Enables farm station use. Yeah. It looks like we don't get anything out of this being a greenhouse just yet. It's just being able to use the, uh, uh, the farm station. Question answered. Yes, indeed. Um, the only downside as well, the other downside, is we basically lose two, uh, width, if you like benefit from the ceiling light if we want to make uh, brittle blossoms. Uh, 
but it's such a small amount of power. I mean, it, it also produces heat, which is eventually going to be a problem, but yeah, it, it's such a small downside. We can always just put more ceiling lights if we really want. Or we could use a lamp instead. Um, let's see. A lamp would cover three on either side. That's less than I was expecting. It's just the one tile. Actually, would it cover four on either side? Or does it have to be both tiles of the plant that are covered by illumination? Four on either side would definitely mean that we could do the whole room with two lamps. Otherwise, we've got... We could do the whole thing with three ceiling lights. Yeah, that's really not that big of a deal. Oh, and mealwood seed, plant, copy settings, go, go, and go. Has to be the tile directly above the farm, okay. Can we see that here? This one is receiving illumination. Don't know what would happen if it was just this tile. We also need fertilizer for this, right? So for that, we need... Uh, where is it? Fertilizer synthesizer? And that requires polluted water, dirt, phosphorite, I don't remember where we get that from, power, liquid intake pipe. So it's time to start playing with, um, it's time to start playing with our pipe systems. Oh, and we can open this now. Rummage. Inspect. A few loose papers can be found inside. Scan the ones that look interesting. Database entry discovered. I'm starting my new job at Gravitas today. I'm nervous. It turns out they hired a bunch of new people. I guess they're expanding. Most of them about my age. I'm the only one that hasn't done my doctorate. They all call me Mr. Kraus, and it's the worst. I have no idea where I'll find the time to do my PhD. Screwed up so much today. Lars, thank you for the follow. You're welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. At one point I spaced on the formula for calculating the volume of a cone. They must have thought I was completely useless. Older co-worker figure out her dumb old email. People say education isn't so important. Got the skills, blah blah blah. Well, I was expecting something a bit more exposition-y than this. But I guess they can't all be that juicy. Inspect. Good morning, Zavoxifol. Good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. You entry. Gravitas has been growing pretty rapidly since our first product hit the market. Just got to look at some of the new hires. They're practically babies. Not quite what I was expecting, but I've never had an opportunity to mentor someone before. Could be fun. Mentorship hasn't gone quite how I'd expected. Turns out the young hires... Don't need me to show them the ropes, actually, since the facility's gotten rid of our swipe cards. 
One of the nice young men had to show me how to operate the doors after I got stuck outside my own lab. Don't I feel silly? Alright, let's rummage. Doing good, thanks. Yourself? Yeah, not too bad. What do we get? Uh, a warm sweater. And another warm sweater. Decor minus 10. Insulation thickness 1 centimeter. Protects from cold. I guess I can leave that there for now. Booby prize? Oh no. Uh, yeah, so this area, I guess, is going to be our pool, since we don't... that's where we ended up anyway. I can always pump all of the water somewhere else if I really want to, but I don't see why it shouldn't be this. I vaguely remember certain gases accumulating in, like, the pool area with, uh... Some of these refinement buildings. This outputs heat and natural gas. I don't want natural gas. Do we have something to deal with natural gas? This outputs heat, water, polluted dirt, no gas, algae distiller, polluted water, carbon dioxide from the ethanol distiller. Isn't there a natural gas generator? I th think so. Is natural gas heavier or lighter than oxygen? Or is it about the same? Can I look it up? Gas. Natural gas. Properties, states, okay. 54, oh, that's the gas generator. Okay. Gas range produced by gassy moss, gassy moo. Mixture of various al alkanes in a gaseous state. Useful in power production. Uh, specific heat, condensation point, thermal conductivity. Nothing about the mass or density. Use it for cooking too. Speaking of, uh, what are we researching? Nothing. So, I guess... Natural gas generator. As far as I know, this is the only way to get rid of natural gas. So, if we want to deal with that byproduct, we probably want to put these in the same sealed room. I'm, I'm guessing. Jukebox. I remember building one of those early in the game and then seeing that it needed like a megawatt of power or something. That's a bit of a trap. Oh yeah, juicer. We haven't built that yet. Let's see. Filtration medium. Sand, I think, counts. Polluted oxygen. Power 5 watts. That's not a lot of power, but that is still a little bit of a nuisance. Compared to not needing any power before. Carbon skimmer. Water plus carbon dioxide equals polluted water. Ignore the fertilizer machine for the next 50 to 100 cycles. Uh-oh. 
this with the expansion. Nope. Mad Mike. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Hydroponic farm. Uh, is basically a farm plus automatic watering. I think. Has negative decor, but who cares? It's a farm. We do have a refrigerator, but we don't have a reliable power source yet. Juicer. Requires 120 watts. Oh no. Refreshment. Improves morale. Recreation room. Mushroom, bristleberry, meal lice. Water. Is this spaced out? No, I don't have spaced out. I think. I've never gotten far enough into the game to use that sort of content yet, anyway. Okay. Um, I think we'll let that run for a minute. And why don't we continue fixing up this uh, layout here. We don't need two batteries. We're never filling up the first one at the moment. It's just going to drain faster. Oh, did we... I forgot to dig this part. Uh, let's see. Furniture. I was going to make this a park. Does it tell us? Here we go. 12 to 64 tiles. This is probably too big. Uh, 170 ish tiles. Um, am I going to need to, like, give it a ceiling or something in order for this to become a park? Nature reserve. Up to 120 tiles. This is still too big. This is 168. Uh, I think maybe this? Yeah, that, that should actually be fine. We'll need some ladder up here just to get that built. And I'm not worried about this for now. Look at those bits of sandstone stone suddenly falling. I didn't realize they'd been supplied already. Alright, so then we can add a park sign. And I want this done quick like so that I can see it work. And see how that goes. The park has to have what exactly? Wild plants. Two wild plants, four wild plants. Yeah. I thought I I, I did recall that it's not something we can just build wherever we want. Probably easier to start with base game. Yeah, I would imagine. Alright, we're about to find out. What? No! What? Why didn't... Under construction. Okay. You'd better finish it. There we go. Uh... Nature reserve. Morale plus six. Fantastic. That's what I wanted to see. Alright, so how does 
where do we look at what's the best place to check on morale i guess it's not under vitals oh it is 10 out of 3 8 out of 1 10 out of 1 they're all doing very well and and furthermore fantastic Sweep this up before we... Are you stuck? Seriously? Yeah, it's fine. That wasn't so hard, was it? The skills window is a way to check decor requirements. Oh, uh, just like what we saw under vitals? Yeah. Oh, we've got idlers. Um, okay. What do we do now? That's 64 tiles. Yes, it is. Well, uh, until I think of something else, we can... Keep going out this way. Actually, that's a bad idea until... until we drain this down here. So SE finished now? Uh, yep, we finished. I don't want to say vanilla SE. That doesn't sound quite right. Razus, good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Um, but I already made a start on uh, K2 plus SE. Uh, last I checked, I, I made like a highlight and cut off the last, I think it was like two hours or so, of the last SE VOD uh, to make that its own video for the start of A2SE. Um, but last I checked, it was still processing, so I don't know if that's visible right now. Uh, but in the final, like, post-victory uh, episode for SE, you can actually see the start of K2SE. Not much has happened yet, we've just, you know, thrown down some smelters and done red data cards and killed some biters. Uh, but yeah, two days a week I will be continuing with that. Maybe worth putting in some air tiles so your oxygen supply can get to other rooms. I think it's getting around okay, we're just not making enough of it right now. Um, surprisingly enough. Uh, this is no particular type of room right now, so I'm not going to worry. Oh, wait. We need to drain the water down here, don't we? Um... Can we perhaps start with this? Water can be swept? Ah. Okay. That might be a better way to go about this part. Uh, mop liquids. There we go. What do we got? Duplicate skills. Uh, adder. Carrying... why not? Crops. Something just happened. 
one or more crops are wilting. Oh no. Are we not getting enough Aziz light? That's probably why. Does it normally say that every time the light goes out? And I just now noticed it? Or is it reaching a critical mass where it's actually dying? I think it just halts the growth. Alright, I want to see this water swept up. The... It's been doing it pretty much when there's no power. Okay. So this is going to go away once we get some power. I would imagine. I also forgot... I think I would like to have ladders between each of the rooms. Going to drain the top Right, water down, yes. Um, which is why I was digging down here, actually. Except we have to do a bit more than that first. Sorry if I missed something directed at me, had people talking to me. So oxygen not included, similar playstyle to Terraria. A little bit different. Uh, it's basically a colony... It's basically what if a colony sim and you had to do a little bit of engineering as well. Like, uh, we're not seeing it just yet, but when you get to steam power, for instance, probably the first time you really have to deal with it. Uh, what do we have here? Oil refinery. I never actually got as far as using one of these. Converts crude oil into petroleum and natural gas. Oh. Only has tubes that will behave very stupid sometimes. I mean, that's a colony game for you. We got bigger batteries, power leak 2 kilojoules per cycle, so it's the same as two of these except it has double the capacity, as in double the capacity of two of these. Also we're only getting the heat once, so it's, it's, it's twice as efficient heat wise, twice as much capacity for the same power leak as two of these. Whoops. Uh, overheat temperature is the same. Decor is even worse. Although I'm not sure what's so hideous to the dupes about something that's necessary for their survival. Jumbo is preferable. Yeah. Petroleum generator. Petroleum or ethanol into electrical power. Liquid in, carbon dioxide and polluted water out. Two kilowatts? What? What? That doesn't sound like... Oh no, that's... yeah, that's decent. What's our generator give us? 400 watts. Uh, so this is five times... five of those generators being run constantly. Coal generator. It's only 600 watts. 20 carbon dioxide per second. 
9,000 DT use of heat. Jeez. This is 20,000. Uh, wood burner. Where are we supposed to get wood? Lumber to produce electrical power. Makes carbon dioxide. These are pretty much the same thing. Uh, th except this is coal and this is wood. This makes a lot more carbon dioxide, actually. Yeah, coal... Coal is, like, clean as compared to burning wood, at least. Wire bridge? Oh, right, yeah, I remember this. Uh, I think I already had that a while ago. Switch. Can we use that with automation? I would imagine. Natural gas generator. 90 gas per second. Oh, that's carbon dioxide polluted water. Lumber is in other starting biomes. No use for you. Okay. Um, I haven't seen any... What is it called? A geyser? I haven't seen any infinite supplies of water yet. I guess we need to dig some more. Uh, also, it's printing time. I think we're good with eight dupes, though. We'd either have to see someone exceptional. 12 tons of algae? Wait, no, we've got 12 tons of algae. This is half a ton. Uh, don't care about irritable bell. Night owl is... Oh, I forgot to look at the um, schedules. I may have picked up a night owl and not given them a different schedule yet. Pretty boring all-rounder. Pretty boring all-rounder. Starts with a tier 2 skill, though. That's not that boring. Decreased excavation, who cares? Cannot do building errands, who cares? But you only do cooking. We don't need a full-time cook. Definitely not yet. I think I'll just take the algae. We'll hold on to eight dupes for a while, most likely. Calories are still hovering at 40k. Um, I really want to get the big water room finished sooner rather than later. Uh, no one can reach this spot, can they? Let's get that sorted out. How's our oxygen? Not great. I hope we're not about to go overboard with the power. Come to think of it, how much is this? Uh, 120 times 5 is 600. And then 360, 400. Okay, theoretically, we could use too many machines at once here. Uh, but in practice, it's not going to happen. O2 production is fine, distribution is not. Um, I'm not sure about that. I'm pretty sure it'll... It'll find its way up here if we have enough. Yeah, I know, but we've actually got quite a lot of room for it to get up. Pressure can build in areas. Uh, 
There's not really a reason to bother with a door here at the moment. I mean, I could always build diffusers up here instead. Just drag some wire up there. I do want to see if... Yeah, look at that. I do believe this is going to work its way up here. How's our research? I haven't picked any, have I? What should we be researching? Ranching? Uh, solar panel? There's the steam turbine. Draws in steam from the tiles directly below the machine's foundation. Uses it to generate electrical power. Outputs water. So it's kind of like a condenser turbine, except we have to actually build the shape of it. Also, where are we going to get the heat to make the steam? You can have doors kept open without losing room bonus. That's a good point. Uh, I mean, they're all screen doors, right? Basically. Like, fluids, fluids can get through these, right? Encloses areas without blocking liquid or gas flow. Wild critters cannot pass through. They're solid. Well, my bad, okay. But yeah, um, if it's... Uh, if it's slowing dupes down and leaving the doors open doesn't make the bedroom worse or anything, uh, why not open these? Open dupes. Yeah, 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 exactly. plus one. Is it really just plus one? Or did we change something? Morale plus six. Yeah, I, I think it really is. The doors left open doesn't matter. I think it's a... Hmm... Okay, we can definitely move these two, and we'll wait for the rest of them. Hey, Mucky. It's your Twitch birthday, indeed. Twelve months, wow. I... I knew this day was coming, but it's still kind of surprising. Uh, very much appreciated for the one year, Mucky. Thank you so much. If you... If you will have some tamed creatures, they may escape. Yeah, that's true. Uh, how are you doing, Mucky? How's your... Wait, did you stream today? I guess... I guess it would be a raid, potentially, if you did. Wait, what time is it even? You would be streaming right now. Alright, where are we at? Uh, I need to fix these rooms here. Not that it matters. Uh, we can't use the farm station, is what I just re remembered. 1850 here? You're half an hour behind us? Witchcraft. Oh yeah, oxygen is working its way up here. No worries at all. 
I think even if only for airflow, I quite like having these gaps between each, um, uh, each room. Toilets are having a problem. Urgently need to use... Okay, there we go. I think the first thing we'll make... Maybe up here? Toilets and maybe showers? Once we get the water system working properly? Uh... Is that gonna be okay? Maybe not. Let's just temporarily put this here and get rid of those. Adelaide. Fair enough. Uh, I kind of forgot the question of how the dupes were going to get over here to cut this. They can actually fill that battery pretty quickly. Oh, I think I remember you could change change the battery recharge threshold for these things. And if you do it smartly, you can avoid this kind of like latch-like behavior. Like maybe we set one of these to start when we're only down to 80%. And the other one starts when we're down to 20%. There's a simple reason for it, or just historically? Right. I think we'll probably dig down this way. Up here would make sense as well, I guess. I kind of want this to stay as like the roof because this is where our um, this is where our nature reserve is. But I guess we can make some other nature reserve sooner or later. See how wide we are and where Adelaide is placed on the map. Check out the true size so you can see how it compares with other countries. Kind of makes sense. Yeah. Uh, did we not get this broken? There we go. And water. The country where cities are days travel apart. <laughs> oh, uh... Copy settings. These go here. 71%. I want to swap these when they've just been harvested. Can I fit some decor in here? Yes. We probably need to find a whole lot of plants to support this all the way up and down. Maybe we'll never find that many. Um, 
I don't suppose we can, like, read them? Bluff briars or something? I'm pretty sure this is the only thing that goes on a wall for decor, at least so far. Alright, what should we research? Oh, we are researching. It's just not going that smoothly. Uh, I kind of wish I'd built this sooner. Can I build this, like, so? What'll happen to this water? Will the dupes build this while there's water in the way? We're about to find out. Uh, what? What? Okay. Should probably sweep up all of this before it gets even harder to collect it. And this goes here. Actually. Water will jump to another tile. Okay, good to know. I'm away. Good to see you again. Well, welcome. Hope you're doing well. I think in Terraria, it'll actually just be, like, hidden behind a solid block. Duplicate skills, crop tending, fantastic. Now we actually need, uh, fertilizer. But we kind of need this room first, I think. Alright, do we want to airlock for this one? Depends on whether or not we can keep the gases contained. How big do some of these machines get? What, what notification did we just get? Log entry? Oh, we already saw this. Research complete. Heavy weave wire. Hydrogen generator, we already saw that. Wattage sensor. I don't think I did see that, actually. Uh, so this is an auto switch. Transformers. Limits power flowing through the transformer to 4 kilowatts. Connect batteries to the large side. Act as a valve that prevents wires from drawing more than 4 kilowatts. It was a very short suffocation alert. Okay, thank you. Uh, power transformer limits to 1000 watt on one side heavy watt conductive joint plate more wattage than a regular joint plate oh this is a block that like connects wires through Heavy what joint plate? Inductive. Okay. Can run heavy what wires through walls without leaking gas or liquid. Connects buildings to power sources, two kilowatts. This is wire plus plus. Carries more wattage than the regular wire bridge. Okay. Alright. Heavy watt wire goes up to 20 kilowatts. 
really, really bad decor penalty. Radius six tiles, yikes. Hydrogen generator. 800 kilowatts. Extremely efficient, emitting next to no waste. Uh, so they do. Nothing but heat, actually. Sign me up for that. Uh, I want to see how big some of these things are. Three tiles tall. Three tiles. Four tiles. That's a petroleum generator. Three, two... Even the basic power transformer is three tiles tall. Uh, automation, we got a wattage sensor. This is what I was looking for, three tiles high, three tiles high. Four. All right, so I think we want our floor to be here. And we'll have to move that picture pump. I might even make this an airlock. So if I do mess up and make some nasty gases in this place, we can at least get them out of the way. I was muted. Whoops. Let's see what we can print. Abor Acorn. Seed of an Arbitrary. Uh, sure. Unless we get a really good dupe. I don't think I want to add any more right now. Night Owl, Iron Gut, Germ Resistant, Squeamish. Nothing but ranching. I don't have any ranching yet. Acorn useful for growing wood? Yeah, I was thinking that. It's pretty hard to pass that up if that's the case. Um, I do still want to compare these, but I don't think we'll be going for any dupes right now. Super, dup super duper hard digging right off the bat. I didn't know they could get such a high tier skill from a skill trait. That is actually interesting. Alright, so Arbor Acorn. Uh, I need to find somewhere to, to plug it in. Unfortunately, the high skill doesn't come with the lower tiers. Wait, what? Are you having a... are you having a giggle? I need to move these again. How about down here?
Oh, that was a little bit close. So, can I just block swap these? Also, I forgot to keep track of uh, if this is one, two, three, one, two. One, two, three, one, two. One, two, three, one, two. Two, three, one, two. Uh. Two, three, one, two. This would be if we'd followed the pattern of uh, four tiles high. This would line up with one of those. I don't suppose we have just the right number here. Uh, let's see. One, two, three. No. You could test block swap with one of the floor dirt near the pump. Yeah. Like here. But I was thinking maybe, like, the reason I'm measuring this right now is maybe I actually want the water room to be even taller. Um, if it conveniently lines up with this. But maybe I just won't worry too much about that. We can always change it. That's fine. Oh, and I forgot to check schedules again. We have an early bird. All attributes plus two in the morning. And a night owl. Alright, let's add new schedule. Uh, move duplicant crossman. Uh, we'll have... Wait, what? How do I... Oh, I see. Bedtime. So apparently three hours is enough for them? Is this an hour? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Downtime is what I meant to put here. Work. Uh, bath time. Take care of their needs, such as bathroom. Once they're all caught up, they'll head back to work. And downtime. Bathroom visits, snacking. Leisure activities. Alex or whatever said oh, yes. Oh, no, 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 nope, nope. There we go. Okay. Uh, where were we? TTS jump scare? Yeah, my bad. Uh, what are their priorities? They will use bathrooms and stuff, and socialize and stuff. Uh, it seems like work is work and nothing else, even if they need to go to the bathroom or something. Bath time. Uh, bath time is like work, but they prioritize hygiene first. Is this modded only? It is not modded. Dodara, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Bezos, is that you? Wait, what? Yokotres, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well also. Alright, so we're going to bring bath time over here. Work, uh, I think. 
So we got 24 minus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Like 19 hours of work, not including a bit of bath time prioritization. Uh, why don't we just add a bath time break in the middle of that as well, just in case. And that should work for early bird. We need another schedule for night owl. So night owl is all attributes plus three at night. Um, let's see. If we do the same schedule but move it back, what, four hours? The hours that count as night time are oddly specific. And then bath time, like here. That should be fine. This is more like Amazon middle management simulator. Uh, I'm not getting them to pee in bottles or anything. We have bathrooms. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Uh, Alright, so this is going to go here. Wait, not, not quite like that. What was that sound? Building lacks resources. We know that already. And I guess we'll put our um, Arbor Acorn down here. In fact, I want to see that as soon as possible, so... Let's get that done. Also, I just noticed a weird priority. Somewhere. All of the doors are super high priority. Alright, so someone should be coming to build this pretty soon. Awaiting delivery. Fantastic. Did you really just build that to 99% and then stop? There we go. And what do we got here? Arbor Acorn. That looks wide. Yeah, it is wide. So if we're going to put our um, farm station here, probably moving it a little bit. But part of this game is the art style, in my opinion. Uh, the clay art style. Don't starve, etc. Plant produces arbitrary branches that can be harvested for lumber. That was definitely a good get. 15 to 40 degrees Celsius. Uh, it requires polluted water. So this is actually a drain on polluted water. That's kind of nice. If you've seen the series Severance, only dupes are full-time innies. Ooh. That sounds ominous. Alright, um, I guess we are cranking up the priority for this one. How quickly would this consume 70 kilograms of polluted water per cycle? That seems like kind of a lot. One tile is a thousand kilograms. 
the thing is, we don't have anything producing polluted water like that just yet. But we can certainly dump whatever polluted water we happen to have, like this, into it at the very least. Oh, really? It seems we need to be deleting um, carbon dioxide. They stop to breathe, yeah. Alright, so this one can be our Arbor Acon. Is there a world where I should go to the trouble of uh, putting in... What's it called? Where is it? It's not under... Should I do a hydroponic farm? We're not that far off getting bathrooms. That's going to give us more than enough polluted water. Yeah, maybe... Maybe consider making all rooms four tall instead of current three. Uh, we're just doing three for these ones. Four is our standard. I think I do want to make this hydroponic. I mean, it's not that expensive, right? Oh, it's a uh, hundred copper, which is like not a whole lot, I believe. I think it's like one tile of copper. Or even less than that. Is this 3.43 times 100 copper? Copper or metal 100 kilogram. It's hard to tell. Alright, whatever. Let's, um... Kilograms. Okay. Why don't we make this room spaced out for arbitraries. Are we going to be able to reproduce the seeds, or are we actually just going to be stuck with one of them for ages? Why can't I build this? What? Must be irrigated through liquid piping, I know that. Oh, there we go. And then here, and here, and here. And then we can't fit one over there. Okay. Uh, I want to move this pitcher pump. I think the dupes are going to struggle with that a little bit though. Wondering if pips will help. Pips. I don't remember what pips are. Are they animals? Uh, we'll put pitcher pump here. First thing when the dupes come in here. And then... Suffocating. That's bad. Uh, without obstructing gas. Blocks liquid. I was going to put tiles that wouldn't block liquid up here, but I guess this is fine. It even shows a graph up here, that's good. Yeah, we've got our oxygen all the way up here, that's not a problem. 
we uh, we need to actually start deleting carbon dioxide. New log entry. I are you kidding? What? How? That's boilerplate. What? How? Suffocated to... That's your fault! You're the one who calculates how long you can be in a room. Wait. No. How did you get in here? You're joking. They didn't build this ladder? Uh, we're not even doing anything. Like, where, where are all the jobs? There's, like, nothing going on right now. Welcome to Oni? Yeah. But no one built the ladder. Uh, who did we lose? Sean, skills, construction... You have to micromanage them when it's critical? Yeah. I mean... There's... Don't tell me there's no one else that could have built that. Construction... Building. It's all just neutral priorities. Also, I didn't prioritize things on this person. You even... You must have had the resources here to make this ladder as well. You've got sandstone all over the place. Gosh. That's pretty obnoxious. Tube's best skill is killing themselves? Apparently. Well, I guess we're printing a dupe next cycle. 1.9 cycles. Oh, now you want to build the ladder. I see. That's how that works. I don't think I even... I don't recall even getting a notification that he was in any trouble until he was dead. Because we got a warning of suffocation before, and that was like less than halfway to suffocating. But this time, just dead. Now their morale takes a hit, might pay to work out where to keep gravestones slash memorials. Blech, I don't want to do that. Do not expect dupes to plan such things. Yeah. I mean, if he was here, and this ladder is here, and there's sandstone all over the place, he should have been able to go build it. He, he's, he's standing, he was standing, right next to this ladder, which is fully built. There's no reason why he shouldn't have been able to build this. <sighs> well, life goes on. Not for Jean, but for, for other people. I was gone for five minutes, indeed. Go delete the pump, yes sir. Go build that floor under the water, yes sir. Yeah. And build this ladder so that you can escape.
But I'm sure I didn't get a notification that he was suffocating. Yes, you did? I, I have like a reflex to pause the game when I hear that sound. You said that's bad. Uh... He paused. I didn't actually see anyone suffocating though, apart from like little things like that. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Build the platform he just died on. We'll get there. Eventually, I suppose. Apparently, sweeping this stuff is more important. You're doing great. We got one dead dupe before day 24. That's the order you gave after the warning. What was? When do we get our print? Less than one cycle. It's not only if you don't have a dupe in all themselves. <laughs> to delete channel points with the naming game the dupe turn over is high uh-huh I haven't actually put the that channel reward in yet Asanda Nima, good to see you again welcome, welcome, hope you're doing well the first 20 runs of Oni can be very cool yeah, I actually saw one uh narcoleptic dupe fall asleep in the water once Amari. Field research seems good. And Otto. Uh, I guess you want to grill. He's got five machinery. Where is machinery? Wait, what? Oh, here it is. Uh, why don't we head you towards mechatronics engineering? Sure. That's fine for now. And then... Research, I guess. Your science is actually not that great yet. Oh, you've got astronomy. Love for astronomy, so yeah. No question. Narco dupes? Oh, narcoleptic, yeah. Muted on purpose? Uh, maybe not. Just wait until you run out of algae. I would prefer not to. So what's your research skill? Science 13 versus Science 6. Well. Okay. So what are they going to do with this? Um... Can we turn it into Soylent Green, or what? Nothing without a headstone. I don't want to build a headstone. Uh, where, how would I even do that? not down here, is it? Uh, 
What a great idea. I found the secret keyboard shortcut to mute the stream. Wait, what? Oh, right. M? I think the memorial was under medicine? Oh, it is too. Yeah, I've never built one before. Uh, wait, what? Why couldn't I see the preview of it? Does this still count as a park? What happens if I dig it up later? Attribute increase. Bubbles, strength skill, plus one. Good job, Bubbles. I guess they get strength from running on the generators. I don't remember ordering this tile to be built. It was probably from when I was measuring these. Running out of water, I'm realizing it's about time I took a break. Uh, let's have a look at our research. Oh, we actually got uh, steam power already. Not that I'll know what to do with it for a little while. Solar panels, lol. Seems good. Steam turbine. Oh, I hate, I hate how you can't like select it and see how it would fit until you've got the resource to build it. Draws in steam from the tiles directly below. Generates electrical power, outputs water. No side effects except for heat. Doesn't overheat until a thousand degrees. 850 watts. Skill electrical engineering. So we need a dupe with that before they can build it. When you find a hot geyser, you can use steam power from that. Okay. Yeah, it's actually been a while and we haven't even seen a geyser. Um, I guess we need to start digging just to expand our vision. Don't we start getting, like, slime long if I dig down to here? Let's maybe stop there and see what we can see. And then... What was it? Four natural trees? One, two, three... I can't have my highway go up this way and keep this as a park. Germ overlay? Yeah. Yeah, that's nasty. Let's... Let's not give our dupe slime lung. That, that would be... ungood. Um, and I guess just to explore, we'll go up here at least. Okay, uh, probably about time I took a little break. Let's do some words on stream. Uh, continuing from level five. Reminder, name that dupe, yes. I'll cobble that together when I get back. All right, 
We'll start words on stream in about 30 seconds. I'll be back in a few minutes. In the meantime, good luck and have fun.
Okay. One more. Why not? One off. That fake X though. Alright, let's take that off screen. <laughs> Blair, indeed. Alright, and let's continue with some Oni. I I did pause it. Okay, cool. Uh So where are we now? What did we just figure out? We've got a sauna. Use the steam to create a relaxing atmosphere. Nice. Name that tube. Yeah, I added it. Uh, you probably have to hit refresh. I'm just going to move these now, otherwise we're going to be waiting forever. Research complete. Solar panel, sauna, steam turbine. Wait, that's not... We already got that, didn't we? Or did I misread it a little bit earlier? Uh, what else? What else? Is this actually as... No, there's one more type of advanced research. But it looks like it's only the very end of the game that we have to worry about yellow scythes. We can actually research almost anything we want already. Uh, what do we want? What indeed... Refinement? Smelting? Significantly heats and outputs. I don't remember how we sink heat. I remember getting to the big hump to try and try and get past the middle of the game, and everything was just getting hotter and hotter. Sound amplifiers for great batteries? Wait, what? Uh, we can make better batteries. 
it's up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the research is called sound amplifiers. That's kind of weird. Uh, but yeah. Sends a green signal or red signal based on the configuration. I remember we need those to control uh, coal generators if we don't want them to just waste coal. Very slightly loses charge over time. Well, that sounds good. Why don't we knock that off regardless? I think we need some refined metal um, to use it, though. Bonk. Pipes 2. Well, I can only... I have to wait till this research is done. Wait, I thought we, we got pipes already. Do you mean the advanced pipes? Name that dupe. Uh, what? Oh, indeed. Yeah, I should have maybe added a sound for it or something. Mr. Meeseeks? I didn't mean to say that you can name it whatever you want. Uh, maybe I should rephrase it a little bit. Let's see. Dashboard. Uh, what did I say? Channel points and so on. Name upon. Have one of the NPCs named after you. Yeah, that's what I put in the description. All good. Okay. Should I change the reward name? Uh, Pawn named after you. Only prerequisites, not for the next branch. Can't you queue research? Uh, yes and no. Oh, the only thing I can do with the vanilla game is like click here, for example, and it'll do all the prerequisites to get there. Um, so if I want this thing, I just have to wait till that's done before I queue something else. Um, but anyway, uh, whiskers, we're going to name a dupe. Any dupe in particular? We've got Adder the Mule, uh, Amari, a little bit of a science nerd, a little bit of a chef, Bubbles the Bubbles the Digger, Grossman the Researcher, Marie the Jock. Otto or Gopher? Otto. Uh, machinery and Strength. Alright, where do I rename it? Um, Otto. Vitals, Otto. Got them selected. Here we go. Whiskers. How's that? Fantastic. Hopefully Whiskers will not die a horrible death. I can, like, click on one of them and follow them, right? How do I do the follow cam? There we go. Good job. Ooh, printing time. Let's do the skills first. Rossman is very, very sciencey, and will continue to be more sciencey. Astronomy. Oh, that looks better. That's cool. And let's do our print as well. Delicious. What are you? Are you all right? That tummy rub, though. Decreased germ resistance. 
and green thumb gourmet digging suit wearing. We lost a builder, right? Let's check. Skills, no, uh, priorities. Building. Yeah, we don't have a builder. And I don't think we just got an opportunity to get another one. Husbandry medicine. Uh, that kind of sucks. Exosuits training. That's pretty good. Decreased noodle arms. <laughs> Decreased strength. Trypophobia cannot do digging errands. Um, does strength matter for a builder? Well, we're not exactly making you a builder, though, are we? Ranching and doctoring. We don't have a rancher. Plus five. It's pretty good. Uh, copper ore is everywhere. Coal we can produce with ranching. So I guess let's get Rowan. Nice. Research away. Oh, and I have to select research. No, I don't. Is no one gonna build this? What's it waiting for? Nothing. Anyone with building priority? Probably not. But we got it done. Alright, so... Uh, what do we need in here? One of the reasons we're doing this is we need a fertilizer synthesizer. I'd like to get bathrooms going first. Do we... We probably have to research it still. Uh, where are the bathrooms? Bathrooms. Shower. Here we go. Sanitation. It's actually quite cheap. Uh, you know what? We're switching to it. We'll get that done a little bit later. Duplicant skills. Marie can do suit sustainability training. Uh, what are you good at? Athletics and nothing else? You're a hauler. Plus strength, plus carrying capacity, plus athletics. I think I would like her to get strength and carrying capacity first. Rowan is medicine and husbandry. I think we want to get you to critter ranching as soon as possible. That's a cool hat, though. You can have the cool hat. See how you don't get the preceding skills? Yeah. Uh, someone didn't finish building this. Well, it is night time. Do we have the thing that deletes CO2 yet? Uh, I don't think so. Scrubber? No, what was it called? Oxygen... Uh, 
carbon skimmer. Is that it? Where am I looking? Uses water to filter carbon dioxide from the air. That's a yes. Carbon skimmer. Where is it? Furniture? No. Stations. No? Plumbing? No. Refinement? No. Medicine? I'm really clutching at straws at this point. Where is the carbon skim? It's under oxygen. Okay. So we could put a carbon skimmer here. Uses water. Outputs polluted water. We need something to deal with the polluted water as well. Um, do we have something for that? Water CF? Polluted water, 5 kilograms a second. Okay. Carbon skinner under oxygen, indeed. Mazzle Fazzle, good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Oxyfern and algae terrarium also works. Um, algae terrarium, I remember, it doesn't say here, but it produces polluted water, I guess. Yeah, 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 I remember now. It was like a newbie trap because it produces polluted water, but it doesn't need to go into a pipe or anything, but it just, the polluted water just collects like, uh, like this, and it just emits polluted oxygen, and you end up with a whole lot of these, and then you, you get your dupes getting sick. The carbon skimmer also produces it, yeah, um, that's why we're making the water CF. Um, so I can't really see... Let's see, carbon skimmer. Can I delete this? Uh, I thought this had input-output pipes. Does it actually just spit out the polluted water? That would be bad. Oh, now we can see it. Yeah, so we're just going to have a pipe go straight from here to here, I think. I also want some of the polluted water to come down here. I can't believe out of all of the dupes we lost our builder. I guess it makes sense if we're going to lose him to that kind of accident that it would be the builder. I have almost 300 hours in this game so I know some tricks. Nice. And... Yeah, I'm sorry, Whiskers. Rip John. Uh, how many jeeps have we got? Eight. So we need another... barracks. Why hasn't this been built yet? Hmm. Carbon skimmer is... Well, it's not go, but it's built. Mesh tile. We can let fluids through now. I was going to build these out of mesh tiles. The rest went into Factorio, indeed. That's a lot of polluted air as well. Okay, um, what else did we just unlock? Lavatory and shower, fantastic. Um, I think I want... How many do I need? 
if we're going to have doors on both sides, it complicates things with the... It's under medicine, isn't it? Uh, with the sinks. Or I could just have one room for toilets. Maybe I should add a warning signal. Do you know satisfactory? Yes, indeed. TNT Maldib. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. That one is a time killer. <laughs> yeah, Factorio is. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Wait, what? Seven. I'm thinking we get rid of the door and we have just the one sink. Oh, I think we need more than one sink. To, so that we make sure the dupes use it if they come in at the same time. So three of these each. Oh, I can just, I can just lock this for now. That would work. And these all have the same inputs and outputs for pipes. Uh, polluted water comes out this way. Wait, no. Water goes in, polluted water goes out. Green is output. Um, we will be needing a liquid pump. This, I think, also takes water. And then... I could just do this straight up through there, but I feel like it would look extra tacky. Alright. And then and then. Uh, output polluted water comes down here, but I want it to go past this, uh, these trees first that are going to consume polluted water. I think what I'll do is bring this to here, and through here. Manky, kick, uh, Manky Kitty, welcome, welcome, hope you're doing well. Routing the pipe straight through the outputs may cause problems later on. Straight through the outputs. Well, they're going to bottleneck the same way regardless. They're going to bottleneck at one section of pipe somewhere. You don't want to route directly through outputs like this. Uh, do we get that much of a buffer just by having a few pieces of pipe like this? How much... How much... Fluid is stored in one section of pipe. It's a matter of merging fluid packages? What do you mean by that? 10 kilograms. And how much does one use of a sink, for example? Plumbing medicine sink five kilograms per use so that's like two four five six but if the pipes go this way it's like it's still a use or two for each of these yeah we can do it this way I could see how the polluted water from the shower could sort of block 
this more easily. The unit does not get ready state before the polluted water has not left it. Uh huh. These don't require power, right? Just fluid, just water pressure. Alright, that should be fine. And then... We want to bring this over here. And here. When you have 14 dupes and only one bathroom. Indeed. Luckily we don't have 14 dupes. I need a bridge. Just like that. And just like that. It's all gonna, if it's all gonna bottleneck on one water CF, this shouldn't make a difference. In fact, if anything, is it gonna prioritize the carbon skimmer or the plumbing up here? I could probably shape the pipe so that they kind of have even priority, if that's how that works. Big if. What other pipe things do I want to build here? Uh, refinement, water CF. Polluted water becomes water. That's fine. This thing outputs polluted water, deletes carbon dioxide. I think that's I think that's a closed system now already. There's no byproducts we have to worry about. What kind of output you expect from the plants? Uh, wood. They consume polluted water, though. You can create a priority with bridges. Interesting. Undead hunter. You can make a closed loop for this. Night dancer. Good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Um, I think we're going with this no matter what other... No matter what other things I put in this area. So let's get the liquid vent here. This way the polluted water will be 50-50. Okay. It'll probably take them a while to build this. Um... I could probably lower the priority on uh, all but the first of these buildings. We probably need some more power as well. Carbon skimmer is only 120 watts. Um, this thing is only 120 watts. But I do kind of like the idea of them being on their own network with a bigger battery. I guess that messes up our ladders here. Polluted dirt for the compost from the uh, water CF. Is this your first ish playthrough? Yes, indeed. Uh, I haven't got that far before, and it's been a long time since I played it as well. Uh, I haven't got as far as having a system that will delete heat in the past. I 
I don't mind little bits of so-called backseeding, like, oh, by the way, you can tell your dupes not to eat the raw meal wood. Gotta find that ice biome? Yeah. But I think there was a way that didn't quite make sense physically. Um, where you could actually just net lose heat. Not by... Not by pumping heat into the ice biome. Oh, we can finish this now. In fact, these are harvest ready and we haven't reached them for a minute. Uh, why don't we crank this priority? Oh. Yeah, this one's not gonna work. A fruit. I'm surprised they still haven't built any of these hydroponic farms, though. Um, let's see. Hydroponic farm needs copper ore. Isn't that how we've been building these other things? Copper ore. Copper ore. Or iron ore. So it's not that we need refined metal. Steam turbines are good to destroy heat, but then it needs to go really high to start with. Let's see. How is our heat right now? Uh, I feel like it's already getting a little bit slightly concerning. Nothing to worry about at the moment? Yeah, but will it be a problem before I can deal with it? As long as food grows, you're good? Okay. No research selected. Uh, what's next? Uh, let's finish off the... Whatever it was that was half done before I forget. Fridge? Uh, we've got fridge already. It does use 120 watts. And we've already got kind of more than we can deal with on this power network here. I think once we've got at least coal, we'll get a fridge. Speaking of which, I need to set up ranching. How about up here? How big does a... how big can a ranch be? Or how big should it be? Stable. 12 to 96 tiles. Grooming station, hasten their domestication, and increase their production. Fantastic. Uh, let's change these doors back to auto. Please don't spill cleaned toilet water into your reservoir. It'll still have germs after the filtration. Well, what am I supposed to do with it?
It certainly doesn't say anything about germs. It says at the bottom. CFs cannot kill germs and pass any they receive into their waste and water output. Okay. Uh, I guess we need to look at the research again. Germ sensors. Solid filter? No, definitely not. Uh, hand sanitizer. Liquid based refinement processes. Ore scrubber? No. Desalinator? No. There's nothing. Sanitation, is that a category? Let's get rid of that. Food, power, solid material, colony development, medicine, liquids. Medicine and liquids. Ore scrubber, desalinator, electrolyzer, disease clinic, hot tub, sick bay, hand sanitizer, apothecary. Improved plumbing? Mm, nothing here. Liquid filter, gas filter, espresso machine, mechanical surfboard. I haven't seen anything that even hints that I could remove germs from a fluid. To kill germs, you would need to have tanks in a chlorine... chlorine-filled room? Way too early to think about it. To clean water of germs, there are no machines. You'd have to heat slash cool it. Best just to keep it in a separate loop or feed it to plants. Um, I would need a lot more plants to consume it all. If I make a storage for it, it's just going to fill up pretty quickly, right? Are germs ever a problem, though? Not that I've noticed. This is what I've done before, and they haven't gotten sick. Never had a big problem with this either. Since your food is not getting in touch with that water, you need something for... Chatter's going fast. Something for your dudes cleaning your hands before they're getting in touch with your food. Does exposing it to clean or oxygen have any effect over time? You can check what gems require to survive in game. You can kill germs with chlorine-filled rooms. Bristle bottoms can eat a lot of water. I don't know if I don't know how many seeds we've got. The bristle bottoms. Where do I check? Here we go. See all. Bristle. Uh, blossom seed. We've only got five. And I didn't copy this yet. Uh, are we not researching? We are not. We will be wanting some insulated tiles eventually. Hmm. 
What do I want to research most right now? I think, to be honest, I just want to queue up something so I can forget about it for now. Computers? Why don't we do medicine? It's not that much research, even. Oh wait, I wanted, uh, ranching. Yeah, here we go. May as well do... this. Y'all are making me question everything I knew about this game. You get more seeds when harvesting. Automation always good for early power. All right. They are taking their sweet time building this stuff as well, which is not too surprising, considering we don't have a builder. Maybe I should just have everyone build. Uh, what's our? Here it is. Ooh. How many dupes do we have? Eight. I still don't have another cot. If we get a builder, we're taking it. Bubbles. Uh, super hard digging. Definitely. Super duper hard digging. And then choose a blueprint. We've got nobody who builds at all. Fantastic. That is quite the farmer, but we don't really need another one. I mean... What is our current farmer like? Crop tending, can also do carrying, strength, plumbing. Just do doesn't have the skills yet. Uh, five strength, seven agriculture, one machinery. Sure, why not? One more farmer, and our first farmer becomes kind of a hauler as well. Hey, I came here to clarify my doubt. Please someone help. My Drekos won't eat meal wood. Well, good luck. Otto is back. Otto is back. Oh no. Uh, play Suji, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Otto is a farmer. And priorities, farming. Uh, Rowan is primarily rancher. And I need our other farmer. Well, you can still focus on farming first. Get it all done. Top priority. And do it. Do things after that. Now I need to find a way to fill oxygen into the room. They eat it off the growing plants. Right, how's our research? We got Duke Box, Lamau. Only needs 960 watts of power. Um, smart battery? We need refined metal for that. And 
power control station. All right. So let's get... Oh. Wait. Did that just finish and then automatically go to this, or...? Alright, so we need 19 and 9 research to get this done. Can we ranch this already? Wrangle, that's what I meant to say. I know there's another patch around here somewhere. There it is. Wrangle. Oh, and there's another one up here. Increased priority of one bed. Good point. Oh, a little bit too late. Let's make all of this priority nine, actually. How many meal would plant for 96 tile Draco required? Highest stress 1%. That's Otto who just slept on the ground. I guess we can do this. And we can have These require water, right? Yeah, they do. So, hydroponic farm. We can put a couple of these here. It would have to. It would be only two bristle blo uh, uh, bristle blossoms under a ceiling light. I don't know if I want to do that. Is there another tree that needs polluted water? I'll just remove this for the moment. Oh wait, these need water, not polluted water. Whoops. Alright, that got done surprisingly easily. We got skills. Uh, adder is doesn't have any interests left actually so what's she good at nothing but strength really we don't really need another amateur cook um how about i've already got one person moving towards this but Another one decent at machinery wouldn't be bad, I guess. And priorities, adder, operating, and cooking, sure. Improved strength too? Yeah, we will. Why is the bridge missing from here? That's a wire bridge. Oh, it's it's not. Oh, I see it. They they built the bridge before the pipes. That's why. It's built, not missing. Yeah. But still wrong direction? No, I don't think so. Also, I just realized that we can use bridges for one-way flow. Check the arrow. Yeah, it's going from 
uh, from bottom to top. That's right. I want the wastewater from the bathroom to go to the trees first. Speaking of the trees... It all depends on your room geometry, how many... Alright. And then... Arbor Acorn. Fantastic. Please don't go faster with water or anything. Oh good, we've doubled our calories, finally. No stress about food right now. I would crank some of the priorities on what we're building, but um, it's all kind of equally important right now. Bathroom taking its sweet time getting done. Yeah, our builder died. We have no other builders. Profit from the extra water they produce. They actually produce water? Interesting. Yeah, that has really slowed down our development. Losing auto. It feels like I, I almost thought we weren't running on fast speed for a minute there. How's our research? Gourmet meal prep. Oh good, we're uh, we're ready to build this. Or at least plan it. Uh, let's see. Food is where we find our critter stuff. Critter drop off. Uh, fish release. We're not too worried about that yet. Airborne critter bait. Critter trap. Fish trap. Incubator? Incubates critter eggs until ready to hatch. Is that necessary at this point? Uh, critter feeder. Storage capacity. Two tons. Automatically dispenses food for hungry critters. Okay. And I think that's pretty much it. Taming station is in stations. Oh yeah, the grooming station. Um, I think I'll put that a bit closer. And we've also got a shearing station. Dracos and Delectavols. Alright. Why don't we put this here? And critter feeder here. What keeps the critters in that room? The door. Um, and I might just lower the priority on these since I don't want it to distract from finishing out pipes.
No tiles outside the door reachable for ground critters. I haven't even thought about that. Alright, we're on our way to 100k calories. Fantastic. Uh, I guess we could... Oh, we are making life slow. Uh, resources... Ice loaf. Uh, how much do we have? Zero? No, we have 21,000 calories. It just doesn't give us a number. Alright, cool. I wonder if I could just get them all to focus on building for a minute. I'm sure something would fall apart if I did that. What's wrong with this? Oh, it's full. Okay. Uh, actually, all of these... Are oh, we can't sweep because this is too full. Um, yikes. I guess we're putting a storage up here. I seem to recall something like putting a storage bin underwater and keeping slime in there. So that it can't off gas? Is that right? Any germy stuff. Okay. I guess I need to remove slime from here, for example. We don't have any yet, so. So it's fine for now. Oh, we should copy this over here as well. Um, I'll make it a low priority, though. Priority 4. Little by little, our pipes are getting done. We have yet another print. Tidying, suit wearing, operating. This is just turning into a tease at this point. We've got 18.3 tons of coal. I haven't even noticed any coal anywhere. I'm guessing it's from the uh, the wild... Uh, what are they called? Hatches? I can't find one now. I'm guessing it's from the wild hatches eating whatever's on the ground and pooping out coal. So we've got tidying, animal lover, suit wearing, increased construction. That is going to be our best constructor that we can have right now. Uh, lots of athletics, that actually helps with constructing, weirdly enough. They can move around fast. I think 
We don't want a loud sleeper. Uh, and we don't particularly need someone who just does tidying and carrying. Alright, I guess you're our construction person. Welcome aboard, P. And skills. Uh, you actually only have suits for stuff that you're interested in. And then I'll need to give her plus morale before I can get a... Wait, am I going to be able to get here? Well, only time will tell. Let's see. Properties. Morale, one out of one. Uh, maybe if you have a bed, for example. That'll add something. We have what we need to build this. I kind of want to see that built. Oh, we got a shower. Fantastic. And we got a pump. I haven't powered it yet. Or even run the wires. Theoretically. Is this your first time playing? Not exactly. I didn't get too far in the past, but... I did play it a while ago. Sigma Beam, good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. We got a sink. So oxygen. Now oxygen is very good. Fantastic. Insufficient resources. Uh somehow we did get fertilizer. I have no idea where. But we got fertilizer. It wasn't from Otto, was it? Surely not. They dug up some fertilizer. Oh, you can find it randomly in these things. You had someone die already? Yeah, they locked themselves in a... Uh, in a room with no air. In dirt, not algae. Okay. Fertilizer is a tile on its own. Ah. Granite, algae, dirt, sandstone. 
dirt, sand, igneous rock. Where be fertilizer? Which view was it? Materials overlay? Can I filter by uh, organic perhaps? What's green? Algae. Slime, algae. Doesn't look like it. That's a lot of colors. Fertilizer. It is kind of bluish. How much do we get from this? 50 kilos, 50 kilos per tile. And how long does it take to go through that? Does it tell us the optional... Here we go. 10 kilo... Okay, so 5 mealwood trees for one day for each tile of fertilizer. You only get half the mass when you dig stuff up? Oh no. Oh no. Skills, Nisbet, uh, all of the farming. What does this actually help? Does it just make her faster or? Well, we can do this stuff afterwards anyway. And you you can have the ultimate farmer's hat, which looks pretty much like the other farmer's hats, I guess. You need ra one rancher? Yeah, we've got one. Uh, we've got... is it Rowan? No. Hey, no. Otto. Uh... I'm pretty sure... Husbandry. Husbandry 5. Uh, Rowan is on the way to Critter Ranching. As soon as he levels up. Also, we have no way to get over here. Or named after you? Uh, anyone in particular? Just Bean is fine? Sure. Who do you have your eye on, if anyone? We got a Hauler. Grossman? Uh, Grossman. How do I find... Grossman... Here we go. Fantastic. You are our chief researcher. And let's Actually, you know what? What else can what else can Bean do right now? Um let's see. Skills. Not a whole lot. Yeah, I think we should get some research going again. Uh, what do we got here? What would be most helpful at this point? Advanced caffeination. Thermoregulator. Cools the gas piped through it. But outputs heat in its immediate vicinity. Oh, I think we need that. Um, to make, like, 
kind of an air conditioning system eventually. That's kind of a ways off though. Maybe we could make exosuits relatively early. You know what? Let's just... I, I literally could just queue this up and until I want something specific I'll just let it run. That might be good. Are you playing this with the expansion? No. Haven't got uh, I haven't gotten anywhere near far enough for that to matter before. I think. Oh, we've got all of our output pipe full. That did not take long. Uh, where's our fluid overlay? Plumbing. That is F six. Okay. Think they're getting sick from the toilet? Possibly. Not a whole lot I can do about it for now. Oh, and sink should be left. Control the diets of the hatches when we do wrangle them. Can't you make them wash their hands both ways for the toilet sink? Uh, is that gonna help? Attribute increase. Machine skill level modifier raised to plus three. Very nice. Right side of the toilet is open. Uh, that's true. Hmm. I didn't think of that. I've seen the odd dupe escape that way, <laughs> yeah. Sneaky. Um, let's crank this priority right here. What I wouldn't give for priority levels on items in blueprints in Factorio. We actually have no. Our pipe loop is not quite complete. So close and yet so far. Wait, that is an inlet pump, right? Yeah, that's how that works. Okay. And we got... Yes, range. Cooks a wide variety of quality foods. Stuffed berry mushroom wrap. Spicy tofu. Okay. We've got other problems. 
It's not quite time for luxury meals yet. Oh, pipe is almost there. Kind of. Uh, wait a sec. Priority six. At least to here. There it is. And then we need the outfit for this thing. This has got electricity, right? Yeah. Uh, pipe block. Output pipe is blocked. Priority. All of it. I mean about this. Oh, can they not climb across this? I thought they'd be able to climb across that. Gas range makes really tasty food, is great for morale, and sadly quite mid slash late game. Okay. Oh, they can climb across that. I guess I didn't need to build as many of these either. Need natural gas? Probably. Finally doing the output pipe. And away it goes. Fantastic. Lord Jojo, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Uh, where's our germ overlay? Oh, wow. Uh, you saw nothing. Also, how did germs get here? Probably because this wasn't sealed up. Alright, well that's functional for now at least. Uh, we didn't print something. 4,000 calories is not much of a care package unless you're about to starve to death. We still don't have a builder. That's really unfortunate. Supplying, operating, we've got people like this all over the place. Doctoring, we've already got one. Maybe I will take the nutrient bars. We've got a rank, a, a, a sort of a mini wrangler here, but with no interest in it. Same for this one. Decreased science, allergic reaction. Oh, whatever. We'll just get some food. Also, why is our acorn still here? Oh, I had to click plant. Okay. There we go. What are you looking for? Fertilization. I guess in the short term I should go dig up more fertilizer.
Fantastic. Can't quite see it, but there we are. Arbitrary. Irrigation, fertilizer, air pressure, body temperature. What's generating your oxygen? Uh, just some oxygen diffusers. And maybe some of these trees? I don't know. I don't think they produce oxygen. Okay. Now if we could just get a builder again, uh, we'd be back on track. And if we could find a geyser somewhere, uh, that would be nice too. Oxyfern turns CO2 into oxygen. Unfortunately, we don't have any oxyfern. Oh, it's a mor morale plant. Whiskers and a skill. Uh, oh, wait, a skill point, right. Not an attribute. Whiskers is probably going to grill. I could. It's actually. Uh, Whiskers is actually pretty close to mechatronics engineering. Let's go for that. Can actually get there without any more plus morale. There was another skill or two. Rowan can finally do critter ranching. And we have an astronomer. Uh, so that's cool. Let's go priorities. Our chef slash astronomer can do researching as well. I mean, that's all. That that probably didn't much change much in terms of... Actually, with these two skills here, yeah, that priority did change. Uh, pay is... I forgot to crank up her building priority. And who else was it? Rowan? Rowan is already top priority on ranching. Alright, so once we get this built, uh, we'll actually see some ranching happening. Perfect. Critter drop off. Uh, hatch. Don't have to do anything with this. Wow, that dispenser takes a while to make. Or Bubbles is just terrible at building. Ranching go burr. Fantastic. Auto wrangle a surplus. Automatically wrangle any critters that exceed the population limit or that do not belong in this stable. Uh. I don't think we have to worry about that for a minute. Bubbles is terrible at building. Yeah. Alright, critter feeder. Now, I recall some interesting and weird stuff with how hatches work. Where if you feed them specific things, uh, their descendants will have certain characteristics. But I don't remember much of how that works. 
What have we got the most of? Let's just feed them that. Oh, I guess... Um, can't sort by available. I imagine it's like sand or something. Sandstone. Raw mineral. Sandstone. 127 tons. Yeah. If you feed them food, you'll have a bigger chance of getting sage hatches. Same for sedentary rock and stone hatches. You have more, feed them sandstone f for now. Okay. Uh, so this is going to be... Hatch. Sandstone. Right? And hatchling sandstone, I guess. Is that right? Does that mean sandstone will be delivered here? Automatically dispenses food for hungry critters. Okay. Should probably crank up the priority on that. Don't want them starving or anything. All right, it's already full. And they already went through 150 of it. You can click on the hatch to see the egg chances and hover over them to see what improves the chance. Uh, hatchling egg, stone hatchling egg. Increases when the creature eats sed uh, sedimentary rock. Sage hatchling, 5%. When it eats dirt. Okay. Neat. Oh, we're missing the fun here. Adorable. Oh, he likes that. Stone hatch egg chance increases... Oh, yeah, yeah, I read that. Alright, so now we've got some domesticated hatchlings, or hatches. Uh, and they're going to keep out, keep churning out coal for us. We could go ahead and make some proper coal plants. I'm a little bit concerned about the heat that's going to generate. Especially if I do it this close to our farm. Does heat rise in this game, like, particularly effectively? I could do the power plant right above the hatches so that the coal doesn't have to go very far, or maybe over here. It's already kind of hot over here. There's no convection. Okay. Um, why don't we build this out? That's going to let some chlorine in, isn't it? When I tried to build that. up here.
if I do, um, if I do make this big power plant over here, I have to, I'll have to move the power around, but I don't see where else I'm going to put it. Marie? Uh, plus athletics again? Sure, why not? Okay. I think it's about time for probably the last break for today. Let's get some words on string going again. I'll be back in a few minutes. In about 30 seconds we're going to start words on string. Good luck and have fun.
Okay. Rip in pepperonis. Uh, wait, what? Did it just, like, skip the end screen? Well, regardless. Uh, that'll do it for words on stream for now. Let's continue with Oni. And finally getting a handle on uh, the fluids. I feel like it crashed. Pies is totally a valid word. Uh, it is indeed. It, it was too early for fake letters, right? Chap Max. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. What is this? Abyssalite. Okay. Um, I want to do more exploring. I want to find a, a vent or two. How's our tree doing? Uh, it was missing something a second ago, but it appears to be growing. Fertilization, irrigation, air pressure, body temperature. What temperature is it here? Like 25 degrees, that's well within range. Uh, air pressure. 150 to 10,000 grams. You could try moving around the hidden map. And listening. I hear anything? When a geyser is erupting, it makes a sound. Okay. So it's not always erupting. I remember that much. Uh, Bean has a skill. Already done all of his uh, uh, interests. So what are we doing? Maybe rocket pilot. Excuse me. Uh, what are your skills? Great hall. Wait, what? Oh, that's morale. Derp. Construction, science. It's basically just science. I don't need another farmer. Um... Carrying, athletics, athletics, command capsule. Hmm. Maybe we should just hold on to it for now. There's nothing in particular we're looking for, and it's like a hit to morale, right? Except it's going to have that notification sitting there until the end of time. Irrigation. Oh, that makes sense. Because we're not like... Hmm. Could I somehow store all of the polluted water that comes from the bathroom? Uh, and then... Only send it to... The water CF if there's some kind of overflow. Uh, I guess I haven't really left a good amount of room to do this. But I, I guess as long as the tank is on one side of... of the fluid management. Let's see. 
liquid valve controls the li uh, liquid volume permitted through pipes. Insulated pipe. Uh, we need a container. Do we have that? I think I saw it before. You can implement a priority system with fluid bridges, yeah. I actually want all of the polluted water to get consumed by this uh, until this is full, and then it only go on only then does it go to the CF. Um, so. Do, maybe we still need to research the tanks. Let's see. Uh, liquid reservoir. Okay. It's under improved plumbing. But I don't see it here. Is it under base? There it is. Liquid reservoir. We also got carpeted tile. Run speed minus 25%. But it's got decor. Okay, this uh, this could actually fit perfectly. Oh, it has like a one-way system. Fluid container is under base. Yes. What if I connect the input and output pipe to each other here, and then? Uh, liquid shut off, liquid valve. Controls the liquid volume permitted through pipes. Valves control the amount of liquid that moves through pipes. Preventing waste. Um, might have to change this just a little bit. Do I need, like, circuit control stuff, though, as well? Refined metal? The valve needs manual adjustment. Oh. Hmm. How much can this consume? 70 kilograms per cycle. I have no idea how much a dupe makes in one day. Hey, Ben Wu. Good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Liquid shut off connects to an automation grid to automatically turn liquid flow on or off. So I'm guessing by the look of the graphic it's the same shape as the liquid valve, but I can't even try to place it without some refined metal. Just blew up my nuke reactor. <laughs> I tried to run it for five cycles. There's nuclear reactors in this? That's kind of scary. Um, I guess I won't worry about it for the moment. I mean, I, I suppose... I suppose it wouldn't be the worst idea just to put a manual control on this for the moment. Let's do that. Liquid pipe. Uh, deconstruct. It is the liquid pipe I just marked for deconstruction, right? Can we get that prioritized?
Oh, it's getting sucked back into the tree. Perfect. Alright, so this is going to require some micromanaging, but we can keep the tree happy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Can I actually change the rate of it? That's good. Uh, did I not just... Oh, they have to come and change it physically. Okay. And then... What? No, we're on zero. What? Why... Why is it... Work errand. Building will be operated. Oh, it hasn't happened yet. Um... Immediately, please. There we go. Okay. Now I'm sure we'll see some more polluted water coming up this way soon. And we'll see if... We'll see what has the higher throughput, the tree consuming polluted water or the dupes polluting, uh, producing it. Speaking of dupes... Uh, let's do skills first. Still holding on to this one. And here we have, I guess, more croc tending. Otto isn't good for much else. Okay. And... Blueprint? We can get Fungal Spore. If I recall correctly, this is one of those plants that needs carbon di uh, dioxide. So we need a sort of upside down farm room to support that. Preferably with some ladders on the top above the plants. Uh, decreased construction is definitely not what we're looking for. I see no plus constructions whatsoever. Fantastic. Spore lives in CO2 and eats slime. Interesting. Uh, I think it, this is probably going to be our pick this time. Uh, we definitely don't want a bottomless stomach. And the other stuff we just don't need right now. Yeah, let's get the fungal spore. Okay, should we do some more farms over here, maybe? Where's the temperature, F3? That's already getting kind of warm. Getting too close to this area. Can I do anything about the heat from this? Like, if I... I don't know. If I... Cave through all of this, does it stop becoming a heat source? Where's the heat coming from? Also, how's our research doing? Oh yeah, I marked that for... Just research a bunch of stuff. You can research and build... Insulation? Yeah, that would probably help. Fortunately, these trees do uh, just fine at everything short of 40 degrees. Oh, how's our fluid doing? It looks like we are going to accumulate it, but if we get even one more of these trees, it seems like it could probably deal with all of the polluted water from the bathrooms.
Um, Alright, why don't we add some fertilizer production? Fertilizer synthesizer. Polluted water. Dirt. Phosphorite. And some power. Uh, so we need to prioritize polluted water to go to that. Wait, what does it output? Natural gas. Oh, I don't want that right now. Fertilizer. Horizon effect. Thank you very much for the 11 months. Much appreciated. Really much appreciated. Thanks for that whole series of SE. Enjoying the variety. Thank you. I'm looking forward to SEK2 as well, but maybe not uh, five days a week after just finishing SE. Maybe not. Uh, day after tomorrow we'll be continuing K2SE. Um, so yeah, if we're gonna build uh, the fertilizer synthesizer, we need it to be in a sealed room. I'm pretty sure it just farts out the natural gas. It doesn't have like a like a gas output pipe or something. That being the case, this is probably also a way to launder away uh, the germs, maybe? Are germs preserved through... Are we going to get germy fertilizer that comes out, or what? Fertilizer synthesizers convert polluted dirt into fertilizer for domestic plants. Well, regardless, we do need a little air-locked room. Uh, and then we need something that's going to consume the natural gas. Uh, the only thing that I think can do that is a natural gas generator. Uh, here it is. And that's quite large. Fertilizer will be germless. Okay. It also produces carbon dioxide, but not a whole lot. Oh, and this... Wait, wait. I'm looking at the natural gas generator. That produces polluted water again, and carbon dioxide. So I guess we could just loop the polluted water back into the fertilizer synthesizer. Um, I need more space here, so that we can start really thinking about this. I would also like to remove all this. Um, what kind of temperature range does this thing need? It doesn't tell us from here. Fungal spore. Okay, what? Mushroom? That's not the mushroom we're looking at. Fried mushroom? No, that's from a dust cap. What does fungal spore grow into? The seed of a dust cap. Oh, okay, never mind. Uh, let's see. Darkness. Carbon dioxide. Slime. Lots of slime. Well, four, four kilograms a cycle. That sounds like a little bit. A 
fungal spore will grow mushroom. Okay. So darkness, carbon dioxide, and slime. Oh, what about temperature? 35 degrees. Uh, that could be a problem if we did it here. How much space does it take up? Oh, this is already dark and carbon dioxide-y. So why don't we just... Just build it here. Oh, not build it, plant it. Of course, then we have to start supplying it with slime. Which means everyone starts getting slime lung. I don't really see how we harvest slime without that happening. Is slime lung only a problem if it gets airborne? Um, well, the thing is, as soon as we break into here, for example, uh, the slime is kind of everywhere. Utilities, drywall, prevents gas and liquid loss in space. Oh, wow. We're further along on that research than I expected. Atmo suit. Fantastic. Exosuit forge. Data not found. Rip. Atmo suits. Ensures my duplicants can breathe easy anytime, anywhere. Atmo suit dock. Stores atmos suits and refuels them with oxygen. Empty suits empties them of polluted water. Uh, so they can go to the bathroom without going to the bathroom. Build next to an atmos suit checkpoint to make duplicants change into suits when passing by. 120 watts. Gas intake. Okay. But what should we be focusing on right this instant? What are we researching right now? Probably... Uh, I'm actually not sure. Liquid tuning? Let's just finish that. And then we'll look for something actually short-term useful. Alright, what else are we building here? Fertilizer? I need to put it a bit further from this thing if I'm going to do this. So it's polluted water in, dirt in... Right in. Natural gas out, fertilizer out. So the only byproduct we have to deal with is natural gas. We can do this by putting it in a room with a natural gas generator. Wasn't there something else? Natural gas generator has its own problems, right? Outputs polluted water, carbon dioxide, that's actually fine.
polluted water will just drop on the floor. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. I just realized I was muted. Um, that's pretty annoying. If I recall correctly... There's a way to separate water and polluted water, right? If they're in the same container. Same for the gas, there is no output, just in the air. Yeah. Um, let's see. Liquid filter? So you have one liquid out of a mix, sending it to a dedicated filtered output pipe. So if we put this, um, if we put this here, it doesn't really matter if polluted water ends up in here. We can filter it out and... Take care, Whiskers. Thanks for hanging out. Alright, so maybe we don't care about polluted water ending up in here as long as we filter it out at this step. Hmm... That would also mean a Veldak. Good to see you again. Oh, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. I think I saw you doing some words on stream earlier. Uh, which pawn do you want? Any preferences? We've got the Rancher who's also got exosuit training for some reason. Uh, our very, very substitute builder. Replacement Otto. I know nothing about the game, so anything's fine. Okay. Uh, we got Nisbet, Marie. Uh, how about the ultimate researcher chef? Why not? Amari. Where is Amari? Anyone with irritable bell? <laughs> wow, okay. So Amari is now Veldak. And working hard. Fantastic. Alright, I think we need to add a filter here. Liquid filter. Uh, which does it output? Let's go like this. Morpheus? Is this is this is this a thing now? It is. Uh, do you have any preference? We've got the hauler. Uh, we've got the digger. The suit wearer. Going to be. Uh, the farmer. You will all die. <laughs> oh no. Uh, the less good farmer. The terrible builder. Uh, the rancher. And that's it. I'll take the farmer. Okay. The good farmer, I imagine. Nisbet. Nisbet. Okay. Morpheus. All good? Oh wait, I lost track. Follow can. What's Morpheus up to? Terrible builder, please? Okay. Uh, skills. Okay. Let's pay.
Ben Wu. Fantastic. All right. Uh, I was gonna put the mushrooms here. Well, we've got exactly one. All of the conditions are met in this room already for the mushroom, uh, except for slime. So now we need some. And before I do, let's get some storage. Probably here. And all slime is going to go in there. Because it doesn't off gas if it's underwater. Oh, um, did we remove that pipe? We did. Uh, liquid filter... I think it goes like this? Why is there something in the way here? Oh, is it the... It's this thing. Okay then. Seems like that would be a worse problem to have underwater. White equals in, green equals out, indeed. Oh, right, true, thank you. Okay. And we can configure it so that that's either water or polluted water, I think. It's One of them is going to be something specific, and the rest is going to be everything else. But the other one's going to be everything else. Kind of like a filtered splitter. Um, can we cryo this stuff? Also, that... No, that's probably fine, actually. Oh! Uh, this got built. I completely forgot about it. What is this waiting for? Just some copper? We're not out of copper, are we? We've got 9.5 tons. That's probably enough. Just in case there's some more over here. Fantastic. I don't think I can uh, set it to accept slime until we've actually got some available. So we'll leave that as is, and then dig down to here. Have you seen roadmap for SE.7? I have not. Oh, here we go. Alright, so liquid output all. Liquid output, uh, polluted water, fantastic, we also need to power it, 120 watts, that's half of this thing, alright, pump, so this is going to be regular water, and Uh, polluted water. It's gonna go up here. 
We also need polluted water over here. If I do it like this... Is it going to make its way here half the time? Let's find out. One of the planet environment idea is to have oxygen rich planet. Things explode when they die. There's also risk explosion cascades through pipes. Fun. Uh, let's do a bridge right about here. And come to think of it, I guess that's totally unnecessary. We are accumulating polluted water here after all. Tech tree will get more complicated. Fantastic. Definitely wasn't complicated enough. Oh, is that a mushroom? It is too. It just stopped because of pressure. Um, why are we not digging? ETA 2024, probably. Alright, there's some water going through. Fantastic. Oh, and before this thing runs... Well, okay, it doesn't have power, so that's not going to happen. Um, but before it does run, uh, we definitely want that sealed. Preferably behind a proper airlock. Maybe I should get rid of this part right here. A proper, proper airlock would also pump gas out of this part. I'm just not going to worry about it that much. Oh, also, doesn't this, one of these outputs, uh, carbon dioxide? This one does natural gas. This one does carbon dioxide. Hmm. Did you ever build water airlocks in Oni? Uh, no. Is that just like a, like an S-bend with an air gap or something? Just that preview on very first page is scary. Very first page. Oh, is this the tech tree? Oh, oh. I, I see what you mean. Water airlocks is almost mandatory. Yeah, it sounds... I don't know, that, that sounds like the kind of cheese you only make after a after your first playthrough, right? Unless you're looking it up. The thing is, this is going to output carbon dioxide and the room is going to fill up with it and then where is the natural gas supposed to go? Unless I put a carbon skimmer in the same room. In which case I should have put all of this in such a room to begin with, but then the generator... Whatever, we're just going to make another skimmer, why not? What's the worst that could happen? Alright. 
All right. Is, uh, is natural gas lighter than oxygen? Alright, so why, uh, I'm not going to connect these up just yet, not until I'm sure. Well, this one's not going to matter. This one's not going to matter. And then pipe. This is polluted. So that can go there. And water in. I guess we need a bridge unless I want to make another one of these, which I don't. like so. And then this goes all the way over here. Uh, I should probably hurry up and make a doctor's office. about here, perhaps? This was going to be coal power. What are we researching? Point seven should natively support docking of shuttle. Oh, cool. So no, like, manually disconnecting it. Uh, what should we be researching? We're going to need that at some point. Oh, did we get the good batteries? I think we did. Yeah, we did. Alright, let's just go for all of that. How's our tree doing? Can't really see... Uh, time remaining 1.4 cycles. Nice. Oh, that's how long the fertilizer lasts. Can't really see how long until this thing is fully grown. Alright. Uh, the tree has grown, now it grows branches. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought those looked... I, I noticed how when I moused over these, the branches are a different color. They're separate entities. Very cool. Alright, I want to get this slime. Uh, just because... I want to mark this as being a storage for slime. So I don't have to remember it. Organic. There we go. Uh, super high priority. And that'll do. And now that we've got it exposed, we should probably dig away every bit of this slime that we can. Rip this dusk cap, I guess. 
What? Well, I don't know. How far will this slime go by itself? Good to see my favorite. <laughs> okay. Uh, did we finish this? Not just yet. Almost there. Printing time. Let's check skills. Uh, can we... Oh, right. You're the one that... Okay, let's see if we can get a proper builder. We cannot. Super hard digging. Shriveled taste buds. Uh, yeah, so we don't have another builder, therefore, uh, this one's gonna go construction too. Maybe I should have headed for the heart first. Duplicate skills, bean... We've got plenty of spare morale here. Maybe I should... Um, I don't want to make a researcher a builder as well. As for Ada, already done all of her interests. Um, let's go for... We could go more strength. I don't think anyone has plumbing yet. Pipe emptying. E yeah, let's get that. And as for Bean... I guess having a spare doctor isn't bad. It's a very occasional job as well. Care package dirt. Fantastic. Let's see, we've got... Small bladder Luddite. We don't want the mouth breather. That's... You, that's that is a ride out. Uh, doctoring and operating? Could do worse. Definitely do worse. Yeah, I don't think we need a suit wearing specialist right now. Meat pitters. I mean, uh, we can house another five without building anything. I'm not sure if we can feed another five. Alright, I think we're just about ready here. Time to connect this thing. It also needs polluted water. Oh, the polluted water's backing up as well. If I want all of the germy polluted water to go through here... Then... Then what? I could have a one-way, uh, like this, and connect this straight to here.
right? Should be fine. Okay, so we need to change this first. Could be fire splitter on lava, fire spitter on lava plants. I think I've already got fire spitters with the mods I'm using, and nuke biters as well. Planets will have disasters, tornadoes, electrical storms, flooding, drought. That sounds cool. I always wanted something like flooding. What a expense. How is flooding going to be done in Factorio? Uh, okay, liquid bridge. I guess can go here. One, two, three, four. That doesn't solve the problem. Uh, we, well, we need a liquid bridge there anyway, actually. And then... bridge like so. Just for the one way. That's not quite right. Uh, it's fine actually. Wait, no. Do it like this. There we go. Oh, do they need to go under here to do the pipes? So we need these ladders again. That's a little bit unfortunate. Just waiting on a little bit more pipe here. Can we not prioritize this or something? start to see spaghetti and oni yeah there's almost no chance to avoid it yeah no i mean you're definitely not going to avoid it on your first playthrough when you don't know what goes where and rearranging it is like a lot of work for the dupes I also want to go get this slime so that we can start growing those mushrooms. Looks like that's all connected. Alright, um, let's let some of this uh, polluted water through. Just a little bit at first. 
There we go. So, all of that goes here, and it can't go back this way. Uh, and that's how we launder away our germs. Um, although it's a bit too late for some of it. Hopefully that'll sort itself out in the long run. And then we make fertilizer, producing natural gas. And... What does this icon mean? No gas intake, no gas output. What? Oh. Oh, F7 for gas. Oh! Okay. So what's your output and input? Uh, carbon dioxide in. Wait, does that mean... No, it produces carbon dioxide. And polluted water. What does it take in, gas-wise? Produces carbon dioxide, polluted water, converts natural gas. Okay, so... I think I just realized we need this stupidly large um, gas pump for input for this thing, even though the rate that we're going to get our input is going to be really, really low. Okay, and we're already producing the gas, which means it's going to be that much more of a mess to try and fix it. Okay. Um. Let's prior this. Even as a pro, you'll end up with spaghetti that's barely decipherable. I don't doubt it. Get rid of this. Is someone gonna take this? There we go. Alright, so we're going to get rid of this and replace... Oh. Uh, replace it with a gas pump. Two by two, just to do a little bit of gas intake. Meanwhile, the vent is actually just tiny. That's right, isn't it? Uh, gas pipe just goes here. And this one goes here. And power. Like so. What time is the stream over today? Uh, in about 10 minutes. Let's see if we can get this working. We've actually got uh, plenty of hands to build this right now. Need a filter. Uh oh. Did it just say wrong element? Damage? Oh, no. Um, how quickly can I turn this off? Uh, F7. Delete all of those pipes. 
and quickly. Actually, make it an emergency. Okay. Is that how damaged this thing is? Hi there, may I ask what happened to your new SpaceX splash slash K2 run? Uh, it's just barely begun. You can see... Uh, I did make a highlight of it that is just this part, but I don't know if it's finished processing. Um, you can see it at the end of the last episode of Post Victory for SE. Matrim, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. And we've got a bunch of polluted water as well. Oh, that's right. I was actually going to let... I don't have a tile that lets the fluid out without letting the gas out. So that means I need a water... I need a... Um, oh my goodness. This just keeps getting better and better. So we need a pump here. We need a gas filter. Uh, we need to squeeze that in somehow. What normally comes out of this? Carbon dioxide. We're going to be sucking in carbon dioxide and natural gas. Alright, so natural gas is going to come down here. And... It's probably laid out like this. Natural gas goes this way, and everything else. Whoops. Natural gas goes this way, everything else goes this way, back into the room. And then we need a pump to get rid of the polluted water. Aren't we going to get polluted oxygen as well? Because of the polluted water in the ground? This machine uses a big amount of natural gas. That's fine. It's just there to get rid of what little natural gas this thing spits out. Where's the gas natural resource? I haven't found any geysers or anything yet. Can we get this done, please? Oh, and what happened here? Got some slime. Uh, 70 kilograms. Fantastic. Let's make sure we get rid of this. Uh, where's the germ overlay? F9. By the looks of it, the slime isn't getting up here anytime soon. But we'll see. Alright, we can finally build this pump. Yet another thing that we have to power. Yet another another thing that we have to power. Uh, pipes. Go here. And... Don't have a way for the. I think the dupes can reach that actually because of all this stuff down here. You'll produce 1200 watt and it'll break wires? 
not too likely. It would this would have to run at the same time that the generator is running. Uh, this will only run for a split second at a time occasionally, and it doesn't immediately break the wires the moment that you go over. So it could happen, rarely. I don't think it'll happen enough to bother with. Overproducing is fine, it's overusing that breaks wires, is that true? Free wheel generator is not a good idea. It's on a separate power network. Alright. Uh, is that it, finally? No, we haven't built this part yet. But, basically? Can they not reach this? Cheers, everyone. Take care, rubber band. I think it might... What's the problem here? No filter selected. Uh... Natural gas. There we go. Uh... Rin... Ri? Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Why did it stop? There's no power. Okay, now do we see... Yep, natural gas and only natural gas. Coming to the generator. And then it outputs... Polluted water, carbon dioxide. Um... We've also got a carbon skimmer in here just to get rid of the carbon dioxide so that we don't end up eventually over full on gas in this room. Uh, so there's only, there's basically only two gases that should be in this room. Um, natural gas and carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide will get deleted by this. Natural gas will get consumed by this. It's going to output polluted water, which we we need a liquid pump just to throw it back into here without letting any of the gas out. And all of that just to support our fertilizer synthesizer without filling the entire base with natural gas. Because it has that as a byproduct of the fertilizer. But yeah, seems to be working. It's actually, uh, the natural gas generator is running more than I thought it would. But that might just be because we accumulated a bunch of natural gas. It only does 10 grams per second coming from the fer uh, fertilizer synthesizer. This thing consumes... Uh, how much does it consume? doesn't really say, unless I'm missing something. Uh, yeah, I'm not seeing how much natural gas it wants, if it were to run at full power. I would have thought it would be hardly ever activating at all. But it does seem to be... Yeah, no, this is more what I was expecting. Just a little sputter every now and then. Consumption you see only in the building menu. Uh, 90 grams per second. Okay, so it would take nine fertilizer synthesizers going full speed to keep this thing going full speed.
Right, that was a whole mess of stuff just to get the fertilizer produced. Uh, and also to make sure that... Oh, wow. I don't think we're consuming our polluted water for... Oh, right, I forgot I didn't. I, I, I only cranked up this flow control just a tiny bit at first. But we can just go full speed on that since we're not um, we're not allowing this stuff to consume it now. I guess. I don't really have a good way at the moment to automate making sure lots of polluted water goes to the trees. Is no one going to flick this switch? Really? Anyone? Pipe blocked. Well... I don't think the switch has been flicked though. Oh, it has now. Okay, never mind. Okay, so the fertilizer is literally the only thing consuming the polluted water from the bathroom, except for the tree. Uh, it's using 39 grams per second. Somehow I suspect that's not going to be enough. Although I do see gaps appearing here, so maybe it's going to be fine. The valve is already open, yeah. Alright, well, uh, I think that's pretty much it. Is there a path for the polluted water to the filtration machine? Uh, do you mean the this thing? The water CF? Um, I stopped using that for dealing with this polluted water because it spits out germ-filled water. So I'm hoping that just the trees and the fertilizer producer will be enough to deal with this, but at this point it's looking doubtful. Maybe when we get more trees here? So it's on purpose, yes. Alright, we've also got another dupe to print. We'll do that tomorrow. Uh, let's see. Let's write the Happy Laboratory. Yes, please. Uh, let's see who's streaming Oni. And give him a little raid, shall we? We've got Coffee Landers Edition. Don't know what that is. I am but an only newbie, really. Uh, all right, let's give this one a go. Thank you all for watching. Do take care, and I'll see you next time. Uh, if you're into the Discord of Blueprints or anything, by all means. If you have any questions about uh, the Blueprints or anything like that with Factorio, don't hesitate. I'll be the one asking questions with Oni, though, for a little while. And uh, let's drop in on turtle number 13. Alright, till next time. Say, uh, stay safe, guys.
I thought was, oh, how about this room? It's kind of close to the right idea. Hold on, everybody. Here it comes. Oh my gosh, hi. Welcome in. Tyrannosaurus Hex with the with the raid. Hi, welcome everybody. How's it going? I'm Turtle. We're uh, we're playing on because you're not included. So I was explaining uh, what we're trying to do for. Um, 